Hey, you guys, how's everybody doing? Welcome on in. Be sure to hit that like button as y'all are rolling in. What is going on? I'm so excited. We're so close to the update. It's coming tomorrow morning. I will be streaming for the update. And of course, today I'm streaming. We're going to be doing some update prep. I think I'm gonna get into some design. And I don't know, we might need to do some material grinding. We're gonna see how it's gonna go, but I think I mostly wanna work on decorating. That's what I feel like I'm in the mood to do again. But welcome on in. Thank you guys for joining me today. Karishma, hello, welcome in. Rebecca, great to see you. What is going on? Nat, hello, welcome in. Debbie, hello, hello. Katie, what's going on? Great to see you. Zara, welcome in. Can't wait for tomorrow. Let's go. Let's go. You know, you already know, up to your day is one of like the best days. It truly, truly is. It's just so exciting. It's just good vibes. I wake up, there's something to look forward to, something to start happening. Like, yes, all new things, all new things. Disney Dreamer, what is going on? One more sleep until the big update day. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Sims Foria, hello, welcome in. Hello to Bulgaria. Hello, Bulgaria. Welcome on in. <laughs> welcome on in. Jennifer, what's going on? Travis, welcome in. Yes, we will be decorating. Levi, welcome in. Hey, no worries on missing yesterday's stream. I'm happy to have you here today. Hope you're doing well. How do you guys think I did on my little Monsters Inc. outfit? <laughs> Let me show you the full fit. Let me show you the full fit. Katie, welcome in. Um, why is she looking at me like that? She's judging my outfit. Here's my little Monsters Inc. outfit. I think it's pretty cute. I tried to, to pay tribute to Mike and Sully. We can't play favorites, even though I think Sully is my favorite. I really have a soft spot for, for Sully, but Mike makes me laugh. I can't, I truly can choose between the two, but Sully is just like a big, sweet, scary baby. <laughs> He's a big kitty. Not gonna sleep, but I think that's how it was last update. You need to sleep. <laughs> you need to sleep. Let's see how Scrooge is gonna treat me today. This place is last day, hopefully the last day of walking into Scrooge's and being utterly disappointed. Hopefully we'll have better luck tomorrow. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Be in school during the update? No, but school's important. School's more important. Me on the other hand, I don't have anything better to do. So I will be here. I will be here, I will be gaming. I will be taking y'all along with me. Hmm. Hmm. Um. Why on earth do you think I need four couches that I already have? <laughs> All right, absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing in here. Let's see if there's anything we want to order. Um, earlier this week, I started decorating my forgotten lands and I did a little bit more decorating since I streamed it. Um, so I'll show you, I'll show you all what I did but let's see if there's anything we might want to order. I hope you guys are all doing well today. My friends, the trolls would love you. If you're playing Disney Dreamlight Valley, be sure to let us know how you're prepping for the update. I always like to hear what everybody's doing. 
I've already watched Monsters Inc., which is something I love to do, is like watch whatever movie um, the characters are, that are coming in the update are from. So um, that's kind of my little transit tradition. And then I'll um, grind for materials and stuff. But I feel like, I, I don't know, I might eat my words on this, but I feel like I'm, I'm pretty set up, hopefully. I never know what to expect for quests and stuff, but I think, I think we'll be fine. I have a lot of um, Dreamlight and Star Coins, although I feel like I could definitely use more Star Coins. I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, but is the um, order limit increased with the Scrooge update? I feel like it is going to be increased, right? Or am I wrong? <laughs> am I wrong in that? Uh, I don't really know what I want from him here. Just kind of wanted to scroll through while I'm in here and see if there's anything that jumps out at me. But maybe I should just go peek around. Um, oh, thank you. Love the outfit. Thank you. Increased to 50 items. Okay, that's what I thought. It is going to be increased. That's good. That's good. Um, yes, I have, gra <laughs> I have graduated. I am done school. Yeah, 25 items is really not enough. It's not enough. All right, so. Um, what did I do over here? I got rid of my Haunted Mansion because I put Gaston's house with Mickey and Goofy's because I feel like it's a cute little cottage kind of vibe happening in Sunlit. And I felt like the mansion was just kind of throwing it off. Okay, the Forgotten really wants to hang out with me today. <laughs> um, hey, Queen. What's up? So, I kind of want to sort that out. I don't know. I don't think I want to leave them how I have it. But let me bring y'all up here. This is where we've done most of the recent decorating. So... Over here, I want to make this area kind of like the portal to the underworld. <laughs> so I ended up moving the wishing well back over here because I felt like that kind of makes sense for like the portal to take me somewhere else. So I need to figure out this whole situation. Um, and then we did a lot over here um, the last decorating stream. So we've got the Haunted Hollywood Hotel and we've got the tree house. I love the little like Alice in Wonderland style arrows pointing along the path. We have the Nightmare Castle over here. Oh, you know what? Let me get to a better time of day. Maybe I need to go darker. So my lights kick on. Oh, that's a little bit of a weird time of day. All right, this is better. This is better. Now we can really see. Oh, I also we've also put all these like green flowers in here, which I think look cool. Yuri, hello, welcome in. Heard that our levels will get to be increased above 40 with the new update. We need that. I hope we get new items to unlock um, and new outfits and stuff. So nightmare. Um, castle here. Brick boss, hello, welcome in. What's going on? Um, and then over here we have Jack Skellington's little house in the corner. And then I have plans to make a pumpkin patch situation in this area. However, I have not figured out the layout. 
So this is something we can work on today. I don't know if I want to put the Haunted Mansion Nightmare version up here anywhere. I mean, the only space that it would have room would be over in this area. So, I don't know. It's also going to be a little tricky decorating because I'm trying to avoid picking up my night thorns. But guys, they're everywhere. They're kind of everywhere. Okay, so let's keep these. Clean up everything else. Yes, everybody's going to get the Walt and Mickey statue. The partner statue. It's going to be so cute. It looks like it's a pretty big item, too. Glicks, hello, welcome in. Good morning, what's going on? Um, and I was thinking I might be putting Mike and Sully up here, but I really don't know. It depends on how their house is gonna look. Okay. I think I should just stop wandering around. And we should just get into decorating, shouldn't we? How does that sound? I've been waiting to finish this biome up. Oh, I also wanted to put a graveyard over here. Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna fit all this stuff. <laughs> I just don't know. Yes, we get the, the new outfit too. We love new stuff. All right, let me set up my pumpkin patch. I've been avoiding it. I need to just figure it out, don't I? I have night thorns all over in all biomes, so I decided to delete them in a couple biomes. I might need to clear some out of the way if they become bothersome, but they usually are. All right. How do I want to set this up? There's these two miners over here. And I don't want to block those. I kind of want to have some kind of path going through the pumpkin patch. And I don't know if this is exactly where I want this to be. I kind of want this to be on the path. Putting the swan boats everywhere. I will be doing that too. They look so cute. They look so cute. Um, oh, what I did is I put these ancient gardeners kind of right next to this banner. So I feel like they're kind of hidden. So I want to figure out where I want the gardens to go so that this stall makes sense. What is that noise I'm hearing? Is that the forgotten? Like crying in the background? What is happening? Is that just like weird noises I hear in Forgotten Lands? I don't know. I barely, I basically never play with this game um, sound on. <laughs> I always have it silenced and I'm like listening or watching something else when I'm playing. All right, let's make this. I was thinking I could put some pumpkins over here. I don't even have all these gardeners I need. And as per usual, bear with me as I'm figuring out my path. <laughs> you already know. You already know. I play on Switch, so it's a little, it's a little finicky. Okay. Where, I guess it would make sense to have the path go this way. Uh, yeah, maybe under it this way and connect here. Unless I move the stall. Can you guys envision what, <laughs> what I want? Use the same scarecrow archway we got from Jack for my pumpkin patch. It's a good one. 
You know, the only thing is, I wish that it lit up or something. Because, I don't know, I just need more light in this biome. And I feel like with all this nice, like, light up stuff here, I would like this to also be lit up. But it's fine. But it's fine. It is what it is. And then I did end up putting path here. Um, that was something I was debating. So maybe this will connect here somewhere. All right, I think I'm gonna clear the night thorns that are just in this little pumpkin patch area. So they're not in my way. And then how do we wanna make the path go here? So we're gonna connect it up here somehow. We could probably put pumpkins in this situation. So I'm wondering if I should move this stall so the pumpkin patch kind of starts over here more. How would that look? I just want these ancient gardeners everywhere. Everywhere? I mean, let me see how many I have. I don't have many that are upgraded. I can't find these ancient cores. Some of these ancient cores are really hard to get. The, the level three ones, I like do not see. Putting the arches everywhere too. You can arch, you can arch. Yeah, the arches from the new star path look so pretty. They look so nice. Yeah, designing with a controller is a little bit of a challenge. It's a little bit of a challenge. Okay, so I have four of these I could use. So I can put one of these smaller ones in the corner here. Let me clear that back night thorn here. Chris, hello, welcome in. How are you today? You're getting um, most of the cores from the rifts. I've been cleaning them up. I just barely get any of those. Don't know why. So we could put pumpkins here, maybe a tree in that corner. Tall tree. Tall, sinister tree. Maybe we want a little red one over here too. I'm doing well. I'm really excited for the update. Oh, there's something I need to dig up. And I wanna get as much decorating done today as I can, cause I know once the update's here, I'm gonna be like overwhelmed doing other stuff. Working on my star path, my quests. Got 11 glimmer today. I only got five today. Like five? Where's the rest of it? <laughs> Where's the rest of it? I think that's the least I've gotten. 11 is great. 11 is great. I have the broken sword piece in my valley today. So I was like running around trying to collect as many of those. Cause I want to put it in my, I want to put it in Merlin's yard. So we could actually fit two of these here if we want. And I kind of want to cover these little things up a little bit if I can. Like maybe we'll put it this way. I just think it will look kind of nice. Hide these, but we get the effects of the auto gardeners. We could even put 
one here as well. Guys, when this pumpkin patch is like really like there's a lot of stuff in here, this thing is gonna be amazing. You're gonna be I'm gonna be harvesting pumpkins left and right. And then maybe we can do a, a tree. A little red tree. I don't know. We'll have to see how this looks on the ground. I don't know. I might just, I might just have one over here. I feel like I need to spread the gardeners out right now, but that's good to know I can fill up this space with another one in the future. I think for now I'll just put like, I don't know, something else. Maybe we'll put some like gravestones or something. Or a tree. All right, let's put some little path fillers here. We need to put something here. Something little. Can't wait to have a bunch of automatic pumpkin farmers for me though. That's gonna be so nice. Just come over here and collect them all. It's my goal. How do I get the trees that only produce dark wood? All of my trees in the Forgotten Lands don't give me dark wood. Really? I feel like they should be giving you a mix. Does anybody know to help tailor out? Um, Jewel, hello by the way. I, I'm sorry if I missed you. Riley, welcome in. Um, this is giving me great new ideas for my pumpkin patch, yay! Look, I feel like everybody needs a pumpkin patch. We all need a little pumpkin patch in our valley. Some of us need a massive pumpkin patch. You know, it's whatever your heart desires. We might have to make a pineapple patch on a turn of the aisle. Cause that's the meadow over there. The plaza trees to get the dark wood. So I had a bunch of plaza trees out here and I got, I got rid of them all. Once we started decorating over here, um, I'm still getting dark wood. I don't, I didn't notice if it was any less though. Christian, hello, welcome in. Oh, the sinister trees. Okay, okay. Y'all, y'all are experts. That's why I ask you guys for help. <laughs> y'all just know. Y'all have the info. Currently grinding for Dreamlight because I'm Dreamlight broke. No, get that Dreamlight. How many? Do, how much do you have? Look, I feel like Dreamlight broke is different <laughs> meanings for different people. Some people will still have a lot of Dreamlight and they'll be like, I don't have enough. <laughs> I'm like, uh, you have way more than me. I think you're fine. So for, so close to 4K, I know we are very, we are getting very close to 4,000 subscribers on the channel. Very, very close. We're under a hundred away. Um, let me just catch up. I don't know how I feel about the past star path the items coming back. I like how rare they were. I feel the same way. I feel the same way. I've kind of already, I feel like I've expressed my thoughts on that several times, but yeah, I, I don't, I, I can, I can see why they're doing it, but I also don't really understand it. Just as a player 
who's been playing since week one to bring the same items back. I just don't really get it, but it's fine. A lot of new newer players will definitely enjoy it. And I think I may have missed some items from the first star path. So maybe I'll have an opportunity to get them. I have my dream light saved for tomorrow. Monsters Inc. is my fave. I'm excited to see the new realm. Dream light broke on my switch. You have 17k? That's a lot of dream light though. That's a that's a lot though. Y'all are silly sometimes. Okay. Let me get some pumpkin seeds. Wait, what's in here? Do I have seeds in here? No. Yeah, they're not bringing back all of the Star Path items. Um, but who's to say that they won't? <laughs> There's, I guess they're just bringing back like some of the more requested ones, but can't they just keep doing that then? Uh. I didn't know it was gonna do that. I never used that auto dig thing. I, I didn't really know that it would do that <laughs> until recently. All right, plant seeds. Let's get these pumpkins going. I don't like how it dropped all this stuff on the side though. Is it gonna water the rest? This is the basic one, so I don't think it's very good. Oh, it is, it's just slow. It's just a little slow. All right, we'll have pumpkins back there. We need something cute in this area. Um, Furniture. Need more benches? Just new options, you mean? I would like that as well. Also, I would like more like DIY benches, like crafting tables and stuff like that. Hope they bring, bring back the up balloon item. I have that, but honestly, I don't even really place it in my valley because it just glitches in and out so much. Made so much candy. I made so much candy to do the paths, the candy paths, and then they gave us machines that auto cook. But back in my day, before the ancient machines, I had I was sitting here making each individual piece of candy. Um. Yeah, there's nothing really good for me to put there. I mean, we could do... The music is so creepy up here. We could do the... Oh, I really don't like it right now. Could try these. Around our pumpkin patch. They're kind of nice like filler items. They go with the vibe. Sucks about the up balloon. Good to know. Don't let someone switch to. Yeah, I don't I don't know if it's just a switch issue or just a me issue. <laughs> but that item just I don't know, it doesn't really look right. It doesn't 
load right. Maybe we'll put that there. I want a little something here. Like, I kind of want like a picnic blanket or... I feel like none of the picnic blankets are the right look. What would Jack want in his little pumpkin patch? What would Jack Skellington want? I mean, you know what? I have like the wheelbarrow, like carts and stuff like that. We could definitely use that. I could also just dig some holes and plant some pumpkins here. Well, yeah, like a cart right in the center here is kind of nice. Just to fill the space. It's a swish issue with the up balloon. It doesn't glitch on my PC, but it does on the Switch. Quite a few items do it, to me, honestly. There's certain items that I just, I avoid. Because I know they do that. And it stinks because the up balloon is a great item. Like, I wanted it in my plaza recently. And then I just, I ended up removing it. Because it just, it kind of looks bad. Kind of looks bad, in my opinion. It just bothers me to see it, like, fading in and out. I can't wait to start cleaning up my valley because I... I look like I'm getting close to my item limit, but I feel like there's so much junk around my valley that I could clean up. And then it would look like it's a lot lower. All right, I'm gonna move these chests. It's probably a good idea to have a chest over here with a bunch of pumpkin seeds in it though. Oh, and we need lights. I need to make more of these ancient landing lights. So let's put one here. Maybe if, if I can get it in a good spot. The Haunted Mansion does that fading it. You know what? I think it does that for me as well. And I think that's another reason <laughs> that I think that's partly another reason why I removed the Haunted Mansion from my Sunlit Plateau because I was tired of seeing it doing that. Okay, it'll be really cute when we see little pumpkins coming in there. And then I can go here and collect them all. We've got access to our mining spots. I just need to make this path wider and figure out where the rest of the, where the rest of all this other stuff is going. Let me make some more of those lights we're using. Um, give me some more of those lights. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out. I appreciate y'all being here. Let's see. 10? Should I make 10? Let's make 10. I don't know if I need 10. 10 sounds like a good number. I keep getting stuck. What in the world? There we go. Do you guys think that the bell bundle is going to be in the item shop tomorrow? Like, okay, real talk. How many moonstones do we think we're going to be dropping tomorrow? 
do I need to add more to my account? That's what I need to know. The cart and the hay looks great. Thank you. So, I'm just, I'm still trying to figure out the path. Like this one's kind of small. Let me see if I do this one. Like I was thinking maybe one of the pumpkin patches here, but I could fit more stuff as well. You say 4K for the bell bundle? Okay, I initially thought it was gonna be like the dream bundles. I totally misunderstood what it was. Um, but now I really don't know how much it's gonna cost because it's gonna be a it's gonna be a house skin, which is usually around three, four thousand in stones, right? <clears throat> Then we also are getting a dream style for Belle. And I remember the Elsa one, I wanna say it was like 2,500 Moonstones. It was about $10, it equated to about $10 if I'm not mistaken. So that's already like around the range of like seven, 8,000 Moonstones plus the furniture and outfit in that pack. So how much? How much are we expecting to drop on that? <laughs> I I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe I want this actually right there. I kind I kind of liked it over here. And then I think the path can go up through here. But I'm also gonna have a gardener here. Hmm, so maybe I want this forward. I'm just trying to like plan everything out and give myself a good amount of space to like improve this area in the future. Cause I'm gonna have I'm gonna hopefully have this in my valley for a while. So if it's like that, maybe this path will connect under this way. Yeah, I also thought it would be like the Wally and Ursula bundles, but it doesn't call it a dream bundle. It calls it like a starlight bundle, which is something we haven't seen yet. So I don't, ooh, I'm sorry. I don't really know what <laughs> to expect. <laughs> Gonna be Moonstone broke after tomorrow. Well, everybody do your dream snap today because you're gonna want those Moonstones <laughs> tomorrow. That's all I'll say about that. Make sure you do that dream snap, friends. You know what? Is it the forgot the forgotten's over here making all these weird like noises? She needs to stop. She needs to calm down a little bit. I just hope it's a permanent bundle like Ursula and Wally's though. It doesn't look like it. It looks like it's gonna be a rotating item in the item shop, like a rotating bundle in the item shop, but I'm not sure. We don't know. Chris, I think you are probably right about that. I agree. I think you're probably right about that. I feel like they have to be very careful as to not scare people away, turn people away from the game. Because everything just adds up. It 
really starts to add up. What time is the actual update tomorrow? I believe it's 9 a.m. Eastern time. That's when it's been, I want to say, every other time before. However, I haven't seen a definite post from them saying that time. Can, can anybody confirm that? Have they officially said when we can expect the update tomorrow? Like the time? I will be going live for the update. I just, I didn't even schedule the stream yet because I don't know. I didn't know what time it was. I'm pretty sure 9 a.m. though, unless they've changed something. All right. Got a little path going. It's usually when the dream snap results are posted. Yeah, that's when the shop usually updates. Oh my gosh, there's gonna be so much to look at. <laughs> what are we gonna look at first, guys? What are we checking first when the update comes? You guys let me know. What are you searching for first? Eastern time, 9 a.m. Eastern time is when it usually is. <clears throat> Probably whenever your shop updates. Whenever your item shop updates, I believe that's when you can expect the update. We could even maybe put a house in the future over here, maybe. Do, do, do. Always do the star path in the premium shop first. Let me figure out the decor here before I plant the pumpkins. 6 a.m. for the update for you? Goodness gracious. You better get to bed early. You better go to sleep at 5 p.m. <laughs> Oh, the realm. Do we know what door it's gonna be in the castle? I haven't, I haven't inspected the castle in a while. What's been going on up there? Anything, anything crazy I should know about? I'm still annoyed that during holiday time I missed out on getting the present under the tree. I totally forgot about that. I really wish there was some kind of like in-game announcement to let me know. Because I missed that. And that is highly unfortunate because I want all the things. I want everything. I want it all. I want it all. Y'all, I recorded a video um, this morning and the video is over 40 minutes long. So wish me luck with that project because that's a very long video for me. And I, I don't know that it's gonna end up staying that long once I start editing it, but I was like, holy cow, how was I sitting here talking that long? <laughs> but yeah, it's a new, it's a different kind of video than I've ever done before. Trying some new stuff out, so we'll see how it goes. It probably won't be up for a while. I don't know when I'm gonna, I don't know when I'm planning on posting it. 
Um, but it was, it's, it's pretty interesting. It's kind of interesting. I had fun um, filming it, so. Soon to come. Maybe I shouldn't say soon. Eventually to come. Coming eventually. I have 8,000 Moonstones, I never spend it. Oh, well, hopefully something shows up that gets you excited to wanna use them. Hopefully 10K Moonstones will be enough for the update. I mean, you know what, it's, it's honestly up to you. It's up to you and if you can resist the item shop. And for me, sometimes I cannot, I cannot resist that item shop. Yeah, I think it'll, I think it'll be a, a nice, long, enjoyable video, hopefully. That's my goal. All right, we should put in another, we should put in some more hay bales. Because I think the hay bales are kind of cute. Kenzie, hello, welcome in. What's going on, big day? It's a big day tomorrow. It's a big day. We got Mike and Sully arriving to the valley. Who's ready? Who is ready? Uh, should we put this here? Why does it just, I don't know. I wish it overlapped on my path a little bit better. Let me, let me finesse this a little bit. Ooh, or we could put one there. Oh, that looks kind of, I don't know how it's gonna look on the ground. I might not want it that close to the path. Maybe a tree, maybe a tree there instead. Mm. What other cute little gardening items do you guys like to decorate with? What else should I be using up here? I need trees, that's... Not having trees is kind of throwing me off here. Starting to sound like Dreamlight Valley saying something is coming soon, but it actually comes three weeks later. I mean, it, it's gonna come as soon as I can get it out. I'm also streaming. We also have an update this week and a lot of new stuff coming out. So it's not like a priority video to get up ASAP, but it will be, it will be coming. It will be coming. Look, if I say I'm gonna do something, I'm usually, I'm usually gonna do it. So fear not. The gardening tools, I feel like the gardening tools are so hard to see. Like they're so, it's so dark in this biome especially. I feel like I must have passed it. Oh no, here it is. Hard to decorate by this haunted man or by the hotel. I mean, actually, it's not bad. I mean, it's a little dark. It's a little hard to see. Skipping class for the update? Y'all are wild. Y'all are wild. What if your teacher is in the chat? What if your professor is in the chat? Y'all about to get busted. And don't come to me about it. <laughs> don't get busted. Luckily, I already have tomorrow off. Me too. We're going to be here. We're going to be streaming. They seem to release the new stuff slowly so that the shop always has new items for a longer time. Hmm. Don't think this game is your teacher's vibe. Look, you never know. 
like you never know what your teacher's getting into out of school. They have lives. They might be gamers. They might be a Disney adults, just like the rest of us. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fair enough, Jewel. I think you're. I think you're all right. I think you're gonna be all right. Um. Okay. I like that little lead up to that whole situation. But we need trees. I keep saying we need trees. All right. Dead one. Dead tree. Kind of nice, like the hay bale, like leaning against the tree. And then the tools are leaning against the hay bale. Now, what is this? Oh, we gotta move this stuff over a little bit. Slide this. Well, let me put the tree down first. All right, move this over more. Okay, hello, can I click on this? Uh, that looks like it's just slightly out of should be okay I feel like this tree might be a little bit is it too tall For tonight's late night snack, I'm thinking... I think it's all right Big. maybe look exactly you gotta have a cute Forgotten Lands. Because I feel like a lot of us have a pumpkin patch up here and it deserves to be special. Deserves to be nice. Okay, I can't tell if this is too close that those pumpkins are not going to grow because it's just barely overlapping. Alright, there we definitely should be good. Let's pop these in. Check our gardener. Should be good. And then, what was that? Okay, let me put in a couple more trees. Need a couple more trees. Um, Chris, I could see your message. I don't think, I don't think it got auto modded. Found using the stone path really brightens up the forgotten lands if that's what you're going for. Ooh, you know what? I was gonna take a look at another path option that I might wanna mix into this area somewhere. You just reminded me, so thank you. I'm gonna take a look in just a moment. Let's put in a couple more things. Um, the other tree I was thinking is maybe one of these smaller ones. Yeah, like maybe right in here. That's kind of nice. Have you seen the new ancient record collection that you crafted a time bending table? I, I, I have made that. Um, it's gotta be all the way at the bottom. 
But you're saying there's pictures of movies on there? And there are missing characters from all those movies except Moana. Wait, I want to look at it. No, I still don't have the V8 decoration today. I have the broken sword piece today in my valley, which I still don't have 10 of, but I'm getting there. I have like six or seven. <laughs> Remind me to look at the path. I might have to craft some. I don't know. I hope I don't have to do it at a time mining station, but I wanted to play around with maybe some of the new path from the DLC. The duplicating grilled fish? I didn't hear about that. Was that a glitch? Was that a little exploit? But you have 1 billion star coins? Yeah, I can see why you stopped gardening for pumpkins then. I get it. Let's see. Let me see if I can see this on this little record thing. So this one, right? Oh, it. Oh! It's the Lion King on there. I didn't even notice. Did you guys know that? Wait, what's on the other ones? I can barely see it. Oh my gosh, this is impossible. The second one is Beauty and the Beast. Is the third one Luca? What is that third one? It kind of looks like Luca, maybe? The fourth one? I can't tell. I can't, I think this next one looks like Toy Story, maybe? And then I think the last one is Moana or The Little Mermaid, I can't tell. That's pretty cool. Thank you for letting me know that. I, I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. All right, let's dig the holes. Oh, why does it do that? Why why aren't they like the the blue ones that you can pick up? I don't like that. I don't like that it throws that everywhere. All right, let me buy more seeds. This better be worth it. Alright, plant those. Clean up all this crud. Thanks a lot, Auto Gardener. It's the Lion King, Luca, Beauty and the Beast, Zootopia. Oh, Zootopia? Toy Story and Moana? Hmm, quite the assortment. I'm excited for the second Zootopia. Zootopia is so funny. <laughs> All right. Cool, 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 cool. Do we like this tree here? I feel like I need a, another taller tree here, maybe. The auto gardener you get from, if you have the DLC, you can craft it. Do you guys think we'll ever get Alice in Wonderland stuff? Yes. Yes, I really do. Alice was one of the first Disney characters. Did y'all know that? It was like one of the first things Walt Disney was working on. Creating Alice. Okay, let's put that. Ooh, that's a good spot for it. I'm gonna drink some water.
I do play on Switch, but I'm trying to just grind for everything I need on my own and not take stuff from y'all. But I appreciate that offer. Thank you. Minty, what's going on? Just coming in to say hi. Thanks so much for popping in to say hello. I appreciate that. Um, I've been streaming now for an hour. I'm not sure how long I'm going to stream today. Um, but I'll be streaming for at least a little while longer. We're just doing some decorating, update prep, chatting. All the things we do. All the things we do. Yeah, if you have the DLC, you can get the, the Ancient Machines. It's like a game changer. We're up to 42 likes. Holy cow. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. If you haven't already, hit that like button. I so appreciate that. It definitely helps out the channel. I still can't see my stats on YouTube while I'm streaming for some reason, but I appreciate y'all helping out the stream. Thank you, thank you. I use the auto digger. Wait, I use the auto digger. I use the auto gardener to dig and water. I plant myself and harvest myself with a gardening buddy to earn the bonus items. Oh, I didn't even think about doing that. You guys have the big brain moves. I just need to do whatever you guys are doing. That's the truth. That is the truth. Uh, okay, not that. Oh, maybe a little red, a little red tree. That look nice along our path there. Okay, I cannot. The Forgotten is like channeling some weird energy. I don't like it. I don't like these noises she's making. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try one of these actually. Guys, it's looking spooky up here. It's looking like Jack Skellington runs this place because guess what? He does. After me, he does. Update comes tomorrow. Most people will put the wall and Disney or the wall and the wall and Disney. The wall and Mickey statues in the plaza. I think it would look good in the plaza. It looks like it's gonna be a really big item though. What if it's like as big as that giant purple fountain that doesn't have moving water? I think it might be. I think it might be pretty large. Do you think we'll get those characters, Luca and Alberto, Lumiere and Cogsworth. I think so. Hey, hey, I don't think we'll get it as a character. We, if anything, we would probably see Hey, hey as a critter companion. Um, because Hey, hey doesn't have, he doesn't talk. So I don't think he'd be a character because we wouldn't do quests and stuff with him. But a critter, I could definitely see that happening. After last night's stream, I was watching your old ACNH videos from like two years ago. Kenzie, thank you. But also, why? Also, do I seem different now? Like, what's the tea? Give me the tea. <laughs> I can't, I, I usually can't bring myself to go watch old stuff like that. Like, I feel like I'll just feel like cringed out. You let me know. <laughs> Decided to redecorate my forgotten lands. Nice. Love it, love it. Could you imagine finally opening Skull Rock and then we just see Hey Hey in there? That would actually be kind of hysterical. I do need to clean up around Skull Rock because 
Everybody keeps talking about it, and I'm like, if there's a bar where I need to go to Skull Rock tomorrow, it just does not look presentable. It looks like a, a big old mess. I don't know. I don't know. I need to sort that out. Henry, what's going on? Good morning to you. I need a d I need Dumbo as a critter slash character. I would die. See, Dumbo, I feel like he would be a, a character we would get. Oh, I thought it was just about to start raining. Um, okay. Let's fill up the path here. Let me save. One more character companions with quests like Pua. Me too. I think that would be really nice if they add Pascal like that. Would really like Captain Hook in the Valley. Me too. And Tinkerbell. I was just so curious to the history of the channel. The mic quality certainly improved. And you seem a lot less shy now. I've never played Animal Crossing a day in my life though. <laughs> I feel like I was never really shy, but just getting to like, like as the audience grows and I don't know, it's just, it's easier to have a conversation with the audience, with you, with y'all. Like, I don't know. I see like familiar faces and it's like, we're just hanging out and, and chatting. But I appreciate the support. Maybe I'll go back to having more Animal Crossing content on my page eventually, but I think that I'll be waiting for the next, I'll be waiting for the next game. I might post stuff here and there, like I kind of have been, but we need more Animal Crossing stuff. We need, we need updates, Nintendo. Give us something. Content creating definitely comes natural to you. It's great here. Well, thank you. I appreciate you being here. It's very fun for me to do this. So thank you. Do you play Lord? I don't know that card game. No, I've never heard of it. A while ago, I had an idea to build a haunted theme park in my forgotten lands. Time to see how this works out. I think that is a great concept and I wish you luck. I did have a little bit of like a haunted carnival set up in here at one point. I think I had featured it in a valley tour or just like a Forgotten Lands tour. Um, but yeah, that's obviously since gone. <laughs> um, I kind of want to put a little path in here, I think. Like a little bit. Or I just want to see how this might look. We might like it. Or we might hate it. But then we could connect this path through this little path. Uh, yeah, that might look cute. I'm going, I'm trying to go all out for Jack Skellington. You ever feel bad, you ever feel bad that you haven't decorated for your villagers? Cause me. Cause me, that's me. It's like a game, it's a game like magic. Disney characters. Is it on the computer? Or is it like a physical card game? Like am I supposed to be thinking it's like Pokemon? 
because I hear a card game and I'm thinking like Pokemon, <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh. Is that correct? Ashy, hello, what's going on? Welcome in. There's so many friends in here today. I appreciate y'all coming to hang out. Be sure to hit the like button if you haven't already. They're physical cards. Now I'm not, I don't play a lot of card games. I really don't, it's kind of a shame. Yeah. It's kind of a shame. All right, this one, a little tricky. Let's try that there. How's that? Maybe we need enough, we need more lights. I know it's like spooky and supposed to be like creepy, but why is it so cute also? All right, then we're gonna make a little path connecting up this way. This is like kind of coming along how I wanted it to. So I'm, ha I'm happy about that. Designing a full biome can be overwhelming, but this is fun. likes let's go let's go <laughs> Ooh, what do we think mulan and tiana's houses will look like Ooh, what would oh i don't know what either of their houses would look like i forget what tiana's house looks like I can kind of picture what, what's her friend's name? Is it, is it, I want to say it's Lottie, but for some reason that seems wrong. I want to say her name is Lottie. Charlotte, right? I can picture what her, like she is at a, a big like mansion. Where, did, where does Tiana live? I can picture the restaurant, but not her house. It would totally be neat if Tiana got her own restaurant and I really hope she does. I want Remy to have some competition. I want food, I want dining options from my villagers, okay? They need a choice. Yeah, competition. A little healthy competition. Yeah, Daisy has been teased that she might be coming. Um, this year. It looks like Daisy will be coming this year. But, okay, what would Mulan's house look like? I need to re-watch Mulan. That was the thought I had today. I mean, I will closer to the update, I'm sure, but... I just don't, I, I feel like I forgot a lot about Mulan. I haven't watched it in so long. Okay, wait, there's like a lot of rocks here. Let me put, I don't know, some other kind of rock. There, now it's just a little bit more interesting. Great. Okay. 
This is cool. This is cool. Oh my gosh. How could you say that about Remy? <laughs> Just made the gardener. Let's go, Taylor. Put them everywhere. Put them everywhere. Okay. Really liking this so far. Spooktacular. What do you say? Okay, we need a light post back there. <clears throat> Just a little one. How do you use the gardener? So place it from the furniture tab and then run over to it <laughs> and interact with it. And it's really easy. If you want to plant stuff, you need to have seeds in your pockets. And you also need mist to use it. So make sure you have a lot of mist. Ember and Wade. Oh, I love Ember and Wade. Why are they so cute? Why are they so cute? I feel like Elemental is still an underrated film. If y'all have not seen it, watch it. Watch it, it's so good. Such a nice, like, fun, romantic, feel good story. And I like the. They'll take seeds out of storage too. I haven't figured out how that's working. How does it know? Does it just take seeds out of whatever storage you have in that area? Because I would like to set that up. <laughs> I just don't know how I need to do it. But I felt like it was doing that to me at some point. Alright, we got a light back there. Oh my gosh. Okay, fair point. For despising Remy, he calls Paris better than my valley. I had to pay for his restaurant and I work for him. Favorite Pixar film? How are you gonna do that to me? How are you gonna do that to me? I, I need to look at a list. Cause if I forget one, I'm gonna be sad. But why do I wanna see The Incredibles? Um, let me look, all Pixar movies. But also like, I don't know, Finding Nemo is a good one too. Oh, when I love the Turning Red soundtrack. Okay, now I'm looking at all the Pixar movies. Oh, I don't know, The Incredibles is really good. I think I have to go with The Incredibles. If I have to pick one, that's my choice. Y'all let me know yours. Soul Coco. Those are both really good too. I mean, they're all, they're all good, they're all good. I haven't seen The Good Dinosaur. You know what other, where, what was that other movie called I watched? It's a newer one. I guess it's not a Pixar movie because it doesn't come up. Strange World, I think it was called. That one was better than I thought it was gonna be. But I, I don't see it popping up as a Pixar film. So maybe it's not, I don't know. The Turning Red soundtrack, I'm not kidding, I listen to it multiple times a week. I love Four Town. <laughs> Look, if we get emotes in this game, I need some Four Town emotes. 
Oh, what if we can play music in our house like you can in Animal Crossing, like on the music players and stuff? You already know. You already know. You know what's up. I'm blasting that all over my valley if I get that ability. Strange World was Disney animation and I agree it was better than I expected. Yeah, when I saw it advertised, I was like, I don't know about that one. Doesn't look that great, to be honest. But then it was way better than I thought it would be. Look, I think the moral of the story is watch that Disney or Pixar film you've been avoiding. Love the Incredibles. Also, Edna Mode is an icon. She absolutely is. No capes. If we could do the four town poses, that would be amazing. <laughs> yes. Yes. Y'all get it. Y'all get it. That's so cool. I decided to start mixing in some of these little bushes around here, by the way. I felt like it needed more like low decor. Oh, let's put a thorn. Really want a quest with Luca. Luca could be a cool villager to have. Cause he, he could be like Ariel and go in the water. That could be cool. They could be besties. Okay. Now here, let me move some of this extra stuff. Just out of the way. Isn't it so funny how I can sit here and decorate an entire thing for like multiple days, multiple hours. And then one day I'll just come over, I'll be like, I hate all of this. Let's delete it all. Let's burn it all to the ground. Destroy it. All right, now this one, I want one here. On the back of this. And then we also have one here. Yeah, I'm gonna need like at least three more of those. I'm, I'm not even kidding. Yeah, these could go behind here. Like I could fit so many of these. Rip all my mist. I'm gonna need to make a mist graveyard for all the <laughs> Dedicated to all the mist I'm gonna use in this garden. <laughs> That'll be our little graveyard build we make. <clears throat> okay, so. Just gotta figure out, I guess we'll do a similar kind of thing where the path leads through the pumpkin patch. I think that's kind of cute. Um, all right, so. before I fill that. Yeah, I think this looks good. Let me see how far over this intersects with being in front of this whole pumpkin light display I've got here. Because I 
one that's held nice in front here. Let's see. So I might do like the path. Oh, I know what we'll do. We'll bring the path in between here and connect it here. So this should be a little bit more to the left. I actually think I'll, I might have it this way. So I can put something in front of it to cover it a little bit. I think that should work. Right? We'll have a little path going here and then there'll, there'll be gardens on either side. Let me see how far over this one gardener goes though. We have all the buff characters except for Ralph, Mulan, and Hercules. I would also like to add Mr. Incredible. Where's Mr. Incredible on that list? Yeah, yeah, I like this. Okay, so let's get this one going. Oh wait, I gotta dig. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Every time, I don't like it. All right, so these will start growing. Clean up all this crud. Guys, what if we get Violet from The Incredibles as a character? You know how Vanellope has her little glitch her little glitch animation. What if we get Violet and she does like a invisible animation? I feel like she will jump scare me so much. <laughs> oh my gosh. But she would be cool. Onward was a great one as well. I should watch that one again. That was another one that I watched and liked more than I thought I would. So you gotta love it. You gotta love it. Is this a little piece of path here? It is, you sneaky little path. All right, so we're gonna connect this up here. Oh, this is gonna look sick. I'm excited. I hope my villagers are too. We get Violet, we would also need Dash. We would need Dash, we need Jack-Jack, we need Frozone, we need Edna. What if we got an Edna mode clothing boutique? She would sell everything except capes. Rebecca, welcome back, welcome in. Hannah, hello, welcome in. Or Dash, but you can't catch him or talk to him. I feel like I would never even see Dash. Like he would just be impossible to see on the Switch. <laughs> he would just be disappearing. Zooming around. All right, something like this. I think it would 
be cool to be able to to get other players touch of magic designs. That could be cool. I don't know how that would work. I feel like eventually that might be a feature we see, but I feel like they really need to improve. They really need to improve the multiplayer. Because there's like nothing to do. Like the fact that we can't even take pictures with our friends is very sad. That makes me very sad. I mean, you can screenshot it, but you can't do like cute poses or anything. The pictures we take, we're just standing there like. It's like an awkward picture your mom makes you take on the first day of school. I feel like that's how we look. <laughs> okay. The only thing with this one is how can I cover, how can I cover this? Maybe it should be over here actually. And then maybe I can put a tree or something on the other side of it. David, hello, welcome in. We need Edna to talk some trash to Mama G. Edna would put her right in her place. I would actually love to see that showdown. Uh, <laughs> Mother Gothel would just be like fishing for compliments and Edna would be, be like, actually no. You look dreadful, darling. <laughs> That's how I take pictures with my friends as awkward as possible. We're just like. It's raining. It's pouring. Sharon, welcome in. What's going on? Good evening to Spain. Hoping it's not too late to see this wonderful stream. Um, well, welcome in. Thank you for being here. Um, no, it's not too late. I've only been streaming for like an hour and a half. Still lots more to decorate. Still plenty of time to impersonate Edna Mode. I mean, that's what we're out here doing. Thank you for joining us. Natalie, welcome in. Fell asleep before the stream started, but so glad I made it to the live. Welcome, so glad you could make it. Thank you for being here. I appreciate y'all for coming to hang out with me. Hopefully y'all are being productive in your valleys and setting yourself up for some success tomorrow. You know, maybe you're just making your valley pretty. Maybe you're just hanging out with the stream on. That's cool too. I appreciate it. <laughs> uh, how is this going to work? How's this going to work, darling? Ooh, what if Cruella had? What if Cruella had a clothing store? That would have to go up. <laughs> You're in the Forgotten Lands. <laughs> uh, that could be a questionable store. Do I want this to go right up next to the pond? I don't know. I didn't give myself too much room. We could put another Scarecrow guy. Perhaps. Low on coins, but pumpkin farming tonight after work? 
Sarah, I am working on making a little pumpkin patch. So hopefully that gets you inspired to grind for some pumpkins. Do I need to make another one of these? Or is it just not showing up? Or did I miss it? Do I have another scarecrow? Do I craft it? Yeah, I don't think Cruella's clothing would be ethically sourced. <laughs> Cruella would be so cool and I want her car. I want her car up here. Oh, a Cruella versus Edna showdown? <sighs> Little fashion competition? Okay, um, let me scroll through here. I think I have to craft, I think I have to craft the scarecrow. I feel like it should be in this area and I don't see it. Oh wait, here it is. I do have one. Oh, he's cute there. Oh, he's cute there. Cool. Let's put some Filler along our paths. Love the idea of a Halloween shop. Ooh. Ooh. I think next Halloween it would be really cool to get a Sanderson sister's house. Like a cottage, like their cottage. It would be so cool and creepy up here. Ooh, what if I do out there? <clears throat> Three lakes away from 60 likes, let's go. If you haven't already, hit that like button, please and thank you. Thank you, um, Disney Dreamer, for the reminder. Okay, that little cluster is cute. I think I prefer the Emma Stone version of Cruella than the original though. I also really liked that movie. I haven't watched 101 Dalmatians in so long though. Also the Cruella from Once Upon a Time. Great story. I love a good villain origin story. <laughs> Want the Oogie Boogie to go with Jack? Imagine if we got the Oogie Boogie house. Because he just lives in like a big roulette wheel dungeon. Like, I don't know, that would be cool. That would be pretty cool. He's an interesting character. He would be, he would, he would be jump scaring me across my valley though. If I see him strutting around. <laughs> you know who doesn't want the Oogie Boogie? Jack. You know what? You are absolutely right about that. <laughs> you know who also doesn't want the Oogie Boogie? Um, Merlin, when he's dressed as Santa. And if you know, you know. Uh, 
All right, it's looking, it's looking pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. Now. Um. Let's see. Let me fill up this little space along the path here, and then we'll plant these pumpkins. I'm so excited to have this amazing automatic pumpkin patch. I truly feel like this is gonna change my life. <laughs> this is gonna change my life, you guys. This is, no, this is game changing though. <laughs> this is gonna be game changing. Cluster, and then I might need some of these. Are you warming up to the idea of po Pinocchio in the game? Absolutely not. I don't like Pinocchio. He was just a character as a kid I never liked. Well, I never liked his movie. It always freaked me out. So no, I'm not looking forward to the possibility of Pinocchio being in my valley. I think I, I think I just have, I'm creeped out by the, idea of like puppets coming to life I think that's a fear I have <laughs> uh because the idea of slappy and goosebumps also freaks me out but he's just another kind of spookiness like I don't know I just feel uneasy about it the whole concept freaks me out so I've never liked Pinocchio Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Gotta go now, but I had fun. Can't wait to get back to work on my pumpkin patch. Levi, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you so much for hanging out. I hope you have a good one. I hope your pumpkin patch turns out awesome. I honestly want the villains to team, team up against us and we have to put them in their place. Um, Honestly, that sounds like a season of Once Upon a Time. That is the concept for one of the seasons of Once Upon a Time, and it's great. It's great. Ah. What about the Muppets? Okay. Muppets? <laughs> Muppets don't bother me. The Muppets don't bother me. Because I think of them as just like little monsters or something. Like they're just creepy little. I don't really think of them as puppets. Like they're just fuzzy characters. But the idea of dolls. Yes. Yes. No. I'm never watching that movie. Dolls or just like inanimate objects coming to life kind of freaks me out now now that I said that though there is one exception maybe maybe there's more than one exception but the one exception I can think of is the movie Life Size where Lindsay Lohan turns her doll Eve which is like a Barbie doll she turns her life size and she becomes human. Now that doesn't bother me. I think because she actually looks like a human then. But it's the whole, I'm a puppet, I'm made out of, I don't know, it just it freaks me out for some reason. I don't like it. I don't like it. No, Toys, uh, to well, Toy Story's animated. Oh, well, I guess 
Pinocchio is too. I don't know. I don't really know how to justify it or explain it. Some, some things freak me out. Some are fine. I think if it's a puppet that's coming to life, I'm probably not gonna like it though. <laughs> I'm probably gonna be freaked out. I just don't like it. Life size is a classic. Classic. Which Disney character is most suited to your personality? What do you guys think? I would love for y'all to answer that. <laughs> Which Disney character is most suited to my personality? What do you guys think? What Disney character is most like me? Personality wise. Well, we'll only go personality wise. Y'all let me know in the chat. I'm with you on the puppet thing growing up Walmart. Had, oh, growing up, Walmart had an aisle of puppets. I avoided that aisle like the plague. I may not have even entered the store. <laughs> what in the world? What in the world? You guys are saying Rapunzel. <laughs> We've got three votes for Rapunzel and nothing else. I've seen nothing else. <laughs> Okay, Anna or Rapunzel? Really? Look, I'll take Rapunzel. There's, look, y'all could have said, y'all could have really just trolled me there. You know, you could have said, you could have said Pinocchio. If you said Pinocchio, I might have entered the stream. I'd be like, well, I think we're done here. On that note, I'm out. On that note, I'm out. Um, okay. Let's see. Oh, I have to plant the pumpkins. Silly me. Alice or Rapunzel. I love Alice. Alice is supposed to be like seven years old, though. <laughs> She doesn't act like she's seven though. Like she's just so prim and proper. I never think of her as being seven. How'd you get the Monsters Inc. overalls? They are from the Field Day Ensemble Premium Shop Bundle. That's a lot of words that just came out of my mouth. But they're from the item shop. They're pretty cute, aren't they? And then I put the mic backpack on. And I've got these little sneakers on that are, they match really well. Um, we got the mic backpack and then I've got the Sully little horns. We're pretty cute fit. I'm ready for Mike and Sully to come to the valley. I was also thinking it could be cute to dress my character as Boo in like the pink dress and the pigtails. But I feel like this is nice. I like this outfit. No, yeah, she does not act seven. She's very she's the most mature seven year old I've ever seen. Jesse from Toy Story. I like that. I like Jesse. I still haven't seen all the Toy Story movies. What's wrong with me? I need to do that. <gasps> Guys, I love this. Look at this. It's spooktacular, guys. I'm not kidding. And then we'll make a little path. 
guess here. Or do I just want to walk through the pumpkins and connect it here? I don't know. Because we could put another gardener or maybe two gardeners here. I just don't have... I, I just don't think I can make them yet. I wish I was like Mulan, but I'm too lazy. Aww. Toy Story 4. I... How many Toy Story movies are there? How many of them even are there? Um... I think I already... Did I put one of these little log benches somewhere yet already? Oh, I think I put it by the portal. Let's put it here. Do you think a villager will sit here maybe? Did I put it backwards? I think I did. There's four. A fifth one's coming though, right? Two, two, two. <laughs> four, soon to be five. I know I watched the first and second one a lot growing up, but I I think I've seen the third one, but never saw the fourth one. The fourth one has Forky, right? Is that his name? Forky, but he's a spork or something. Yeah, I never saw that one. The third one's with the daycare, right? I saw that one. I always liked the second one. You know another character I hope never comes to Disney Dreamlight Valley? And I think a lot of you guys will agree with me. What's his name? What's that guy's name? I think I know his name. But it also seems wrong. <laughs> I started Googling it and it knew exactly what movie I was talking about. Sid. That's his name. Sid. I started to look up what's the bad kid's name and then it said in Toy Story. Yes, yeah, Sid is not welcome in my valley. Please never bring him to Disney Dreamlight Valley. He's a villain we don't need. We do not need him in Disney Dreamlight Valley. <laughs> Can you imagine? He just destroys everything. Do do. All right. How shall I do this? Should I put a path like that? Or just a path here? Mm. Honestly, I might put another machine here and have more crops. You won't like the fourth Toy Story because it has creepy puppets and living sporks. I just, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll never watch it then. Are you telling me I should never watch it? Never. Not ever. Would be so funny if we got Barbie and Ken. Toy Story 3 in the game. I wonder how that might work with licensing and st like all the IP and stuff. How does that work? 
because it's like Mattel, but it's also like Disney, so I don't know. Interesting. Okay. I'm thinking don't do that. Should I put a tree behind the stall, maybe? There's creepy puppets in Toy Story 4? Are you guys serious? Oh, maybe we should do a rock. One of those big rocks. Until I can put another gardener here. Hey, guess I'm never seeing Toy Story 4. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You guys just tried to casually forget that there's puppets in Toy Story 4. I'll remember that. Try to trick me. Doo -doo. Isn't the fourth, is the fourth one the one that everybody cries over? really good if you watch Goosebumps you can watch anything really was Goosebumps that scary okay Goosebumps did not start out off that okay no no, no. it was scary but it 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 got very dark at the end I'm still a little creeped out by some of the things I saw on that show. <laughs> but still good, still good. I mean, it went, a, it went a little off the rails for me, personally. Didn't like some of the direction they went in. I like Slinky. Slinky the dog. Decorating the rain right now is kind of relaxing. It's not usually this nice. You know, like anytime I'm trying to decorate something cutesy in my meadow, you know, then I don't really appreciate the rain. But right now, this is kind of nice. It's setting the vibe. Feeling like one of those ambiance videos right now. I put those on all the time. <laughs> Doo -doo. Why does this spot look so weird? Okay, maybe we just need to adjust this. Smidge. All right, we're nearly there. Just a few more bits to scatter throughout. I 
Thank you guys for hanging out and keeping me company. Definitely laughing a lot, so I appreciate that. We're having fun. All right, put these in here. like barely not fitting right. So let's just adjust this a little. That's good. Let's see how this looks. I'm on to you guys. Lotso was scary. I just didn't like him. Do you know you can place stuff inside of Rapunzel's fireplace to make it look like something's burning inside of it? No, I didn't know that. But last time we had that ability, they took it away from us. With the Dreamlight Fountain. So we'll put another gardener here when we get when we get one. Now, do you think the path should go under this? Maybe not. Maybe I'm just gonna put a rock or fern or something. One of my go-to's. Let's just do some stones. So grab one more fern. Oh, and we have to put out lights on the roads. Take advantage of it while you can. I mean, what are you putting in there? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay. Oh, I forgot I was going to try to make that other path. Let me go to my crafting bench. I should put in more of these benches too. Okay, let's save. Do, 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 do. Yeah, right now I'm working on decorating the Forgotten Lands. We've been making a pumpkin patch, honestly, for the past two two hours <laughs> I've been working on this biome now for two hours today how is it still not done how um path is it this one see what this looks like. I don't think this is the one I was thinking of. Okay, look how cool this path is. Cause it like shows the, I don't know. I feel like it looks really good. It shows the dirt underneath it. I feel 
feel like this could be a good one to use up here somewhere. Like maybe under the well. So I want to remember to use that if I if it feels appropriate. I think it could be cool. Although it's kind of a little late for me to do that. Because everything is nearly fully decorated. <laughs> Oops. The pebble path, I, that's going to eat all my materials. <laughs> I can't. I can't make that. Okay, let me see if I could make maybe one more gardener. Just to put in that spot for now. Oh, speaking of Remy. Oh, I need to get rid of some of these bushes. I'm always running into them. Okay, ancient gardener. Let me get a regular gardener. But I can't make any of the advanced ones. I have no cores. That path is so good. I I want to use it in many places. Okay, let's finish up this area. We need to add in just a few light posts. I also need to get more of those glowing green flowers. And we need to pop in this new gardener. Let me save. Four likes away from 70 likes. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for letting us know. If you haven't already, hit that like button. Um, thank you guys for all the love you've been showing on the stream already. Um, Disney Dreamer, thank you so much for hanging out. Have a great rest of your day. I appreciate y'all. Okay, let me see. The utilities? Here we go. And this will put I think I'll put it mm, I think right there. And then we can put in a few hay hay bales and stuff like that too. I feel like I need to mix in some more of those. Don't let me forget the lights. We need the light. Let there be light. Uh, I think that's too in the way. But I really can't tell. I wish I could see where I was gonna put the holes while I was still decorating. Click on it. Um, hello? Okay. It needs to be a, a little bit moved. How is that? Cool. We can put a tree in back of that. Let's get a big creepy tree. Maybe one of these. Let's put that back there. Let's 
Okay, lights. Let's get more lights out. Do, do, do. Um, let's put one of these here. Any more than that? What do y'all think? Maybe one there? And I think we need some of those scraggly. We need some bushes, thorns. Oh my gosh, I've placed so many items. I placed so many items. I think I'm up at least 200 items since the start of the stream. Whoops. Oh well. Here I go. Pile. Here I go, piling in more. Uh, oh, I always forget that those bushes are under trees for some reason. Uh. Little tree trunk. I think that's gonna be in our way. All right, where are the bushes? This one. Mix in some of these wherever we can fit it. Okay. It's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. What do y'all think? It's a little hard to tell in the rain. But I like it. I think I'm really happy with how this turned out. I think it's kind of better than I thought it would be. Ancient machine is not active? What does that mean? What does that mean, y'all? Not active. Is there something too close to it? I don't understand. What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong here? Bye, Rebecca. Thanks so much for hanging out. Have a great rest of your day. Is it more than four? You can only have four machines per biome? Um, yeah, it is more than four. That's my fifth one. You can only have four per biome? Rats. Well, shoot, that foils my little plan there. Why can you only have four? Why did nobody tell me that until now? I told y'all I'm trying to make a massive pumpkin farm with automatic gardeners. I kind of want to put the fairy godmother's house there now. Uh, I don't think she would like that. I don't know. 
feel like doing something wild. Did we do it? wanted another pumpkin patch there. I could just dig one up. Like the old fashioned way. Or we could move Fairy Godmother. Scar's house is not going to fit. I was thinking maybe of putting Scar in this area. But then the thing is I have no idea what to do with this elephant graveyard. You think her house looks cute there? Does it look cuter than it does in the meadow? I mean, I'm kind of in the mood to redo my meadow as well because I just feel like my meadow can be improved. It brightens up that spot and brings out more orange. Wait, you guys are convincing me. I just feel like Jack needs some neighbors. He's got nobody over here. Daisy, hello, welcome in. Look, once upon a time, I moved the fairy godmother to the meadow to be closer to Merlin because I thought that we were shipping them. But since then, I've moved Merlin to Ancient Slumber. Look, I think they broke up. <laughs> They're on a break. Merlin moved to Ancient's Landing, and Fairy Godmother has now moved back to the Forgotten Lands. So, Fairy Godmother is happy anywhere you put her, though. That that's fine. She's happy wherever. How's that? How's that? We just need some little doodads. We need some cute little trinkets and things. She's too good for him to be honest. I guess it's fine. She's moved on. Love your design? Why, thank you, Taylor. I appreciate the love in all caps. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Y'all, we on to something. I kind of like that it's like a little surprise that her house is back there. Look, you can't really see it. And then you loop, loop, loop around and it's like, oh! Fairy Godmother's up here. Okay, I think we, I don't know. I, I feel like I just need like, something a little cute for Fairy Godmother, like. I don't know. Maybe we, I don't know. Let me see what I put in front of her house before. I know I had that little carriage with the pumpkins. But does this really go up there?
Okay, that there is kind of cute. <laughs> it's kind of cute. You know the name? We're getting a lot of rain on these pumpkins. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about the little cart. It doesn't really suit this biome. But it suits her. If we don't do that, what else could we do? Let's see if there's anything else I want to steal from in front of her house. I mean, I have this like regular pumpkins. Not the jack-o'-lanterns. I don't think she can get inside. I don't think she can get in and out if they're there. Yeah, I like that a little bit more, though. That does look better than the cart, right? The cart is just... It's not the look we want. Okay, her house is, like, very basic, though. Is it done? Do we need more stuff? Some little flower pots? I don't know. As my item limit just keeps getting higher and higher. I mean, it's cute. It's just pretty simple. I kind of wish it would stop raining now. So we can see if we really like this. I think if I can, I'm going to try to switch this bush, bush out to one of the healthy looking ones. Maybe it wouldn't fit. Oh, and I have to put in some green flowers. Need some gro glowing green flowers. I thought there was one over here. Oh, I placed it. Okay. Let me get some more of those flowers. Hopefully it stops raining. I I need to decorate Skull Rock too, I think. Alright, let me go to my house. It's this way. I swear I live here. Okay, let me go to my house, get green light up flowers. And then I don't know if I want to do that little portal area or move on to something else. What are we feeling? Is it thunderstorming? Am I game now? Have so many night thorns all over, I can't even decorate right now. I'm saving them for tomorrow's star path and just trying to get through some quests. I am trying to do the same thing, but if there's night thorns, 
in my way of where I'm decorating, I'm just gonna remove those. Like, I'm trying to avoid as, picking up as many as I can. But if it's prohibiting me from designing right now, I'm just cleaning it up. I've cleaned up like three. Oh, it is thunderstorming. It's spooky. Let's get, ugh, I want all of them. Let me get 10. Let me start with 10. Guys, we are almost to 75 likes. If you haven't already, smash that like button. Please and thank you. You guys are killing it with the love on the stream today. I really, really appreciate it. Especially as we're inching closer to 4,000 subs. Um, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We're getting there. We are getting there. She's scary today. Why is she so scary? All right, let me drop these over here. I've been using my auto cooker to make just like random meals to help me gain mist. Cause you get mist from like cooking with Eternity Isle vegetables or spices and stuff like that. So I've been trying to just make like random foods and max those out. Please stop raining soon, Valley. All right, let's bring some of these through our pumpkin patch. We gotta have some by Fairy Godmother because she deserves it. I'm gonna have some to drink real fast. Okay, back to it. Ooh, I wonder if we can put in any more of these. Is there anywhere that it fits and makes sense? Looking like maybe not. Maybe in the front. All right, probably don't need that one. The ramen recipe in the game looks really good. Makes me want some in real life. It. Makes me hungry to look at some of the food. Today I was looking at all the food that I hadn't unlocked. And I gotta be honest, I was tempted to start unlocking them. But man, that's gonna be time consuming. <laughs> to sit there and put in all those recipes. Yeah, I'm kind of not looking forward to that. But I'm also in the mood where I want everything like 100%ed. So I'm torn. I gotta do it eventually. I might just start to do it slowly here and there. And then it's not like as big of a chore as like sitting down and doing it all at once. 
Because I also have to unlock them for Eternity Isle too. Like, I don't even have all the recipes in the base game unlocked yet. I want to use this Pumpkin King throne. Where can it go? <laughs> Where should I put it? Uh, where does it go, y'all? Any ideas? Somewhere by Jack's house? There's no real good spot for it now. Cool. When you come through the gate, you'll see it. Maybe there. Okay, actually, no. <laughs> Looks really bad, though, from that angle. Um, oh god. Where should it go? Games. Okay, good to know. Thank you, thank you. I will look for the list of all the recipes. It's just such a chore. Rick Boss, good luck with the decorating. Oh, wait, why is it kind of cute right there? But then we also have this bench here. Okay, but what are the odds if if a villager sits here and here? It would look very strange. That might be an okay spot. Let's see. The decorista, hello, welcome in. Yay, it stopped raining. I mean, is that where it should go? I don't know where else it would look good. New name, hello, welcome in. What's going on? Thanks so much for smashing that like button. I appreciate you. We have been, I've been decorating the Forgotten Lands for two and a half hours now. I'm still not done. Ooh, what if it's here? What if it's here? Kind of next to Goofy stalls, kind of cute. sure they can get to it okay I think I like that better yay I like that it has a little spot oh, that's so cute too okay now let's just adjust the path maybe and get the path We're at 79 likes, let's go. 
not somebody coming in here and trying to tell me I'm a kid as a full grown adult. That's a quick way for you to get banned. You're being rude. Seventeen <laughs> percent of the meals. I don't know how many I have. Not enough. Okay, why is it like a harsh line right there? I like it. I like it. Like, how are you going to come into my stream and tell me not to play the game I'm playing? If you don't like the game I'm playing, go watch the game. <laughs> go watch the game you want to play. I, I don't get it. Don't come in my chat like that. We're over here having a good time. It's a quick way to get banned. Killing the vibe? Or trying to? Nice try. Anyway. Anyway. Back to our regularly scheduled program. Lola! Is that... Let me get my little monocle. Is that Lola in my chat? Lola, what's going on? It has been so long. Don't apologize, though. I hope everything's well for you. I'm so happy to see you popping in. What's going on? Um, somebody would just came in and was being rude. <laughs> just coming in and being rude, and I, I just don't care. I just don't care, to be quite honest. I don't even want to spend time talking about it. It's just... I just don't get it. Don't come in my chat and complain about the game we're playing. Go watch the other game you want to play then. <laughs> just rude. Just rude. Um, okay. Let's put in a few more flowers. Just a few. I think this is looking good. I think this is looking good. If you're just jumping in, we've been decorating the Forgotten Lands for nearly three hours now. <laughs> it's all been three hours now that I look at it. And um, yeah, still not done, but it's looking good. I decided, we decided to move the Fairy Godmother up here again. That's okay, no worries. Yeah, it's okay if Disney Dreamlight Valley isn't for you, but don't come into a chat full of people who love Disney Dreamlight Valley and we're all hanging out and having a good time and be rude. That's all. If you have nothing nice to say, don't say anything at all. I'm so glad you're my friend. Also, I'm definitely not a kid. Nice try. Nice try. Okay. It's coming along very nicely. How can you not love the game? It's the best cozy game to play in the music. I don't, I actually don't like the music in the game, but I, I don't think that it's, that I don't like the songs. I just don't think that they're like balanced like it's just not the best mix like sometimes the song get songs get very loud and other times then they get really quiet and then the music picks back up again and I'm, I don't know that's why I turn it off and just play my own 
Okay, I feel like this is, this is good. We could put something here, but. It's looking fantastic, love the colors and you even made Jack's throne not look awkward. Thank you, that was my goal. Cause it does look quite awkward in a lot of spots, but it's kind of cute like, wait, it's like Jack sits here and waits for customers at Goofy's stall to buy his pumpkins. Um, Fairy Godmother will help you be able to get rid of the green fires in this biome. So keep doing your quests eventually when you get Fairy Godmother. She'll help you move, remove them. Oh yeah, the mobile streams, I can only imagine because that's just welcoming in a whole nother group of people who aren't like, they don't know your content, they don't know you and it's just, I, I don't have time for negativity on the internet. Like the internet, for me, I just want it to be like a fun little place I can escape to occasionally and have a good time. I don't want drama, I don't want negativity, I don't want anything like that. Like go somewhere else, <laughs> just go somewhere else. Like I'm not here for that. We're not here for that. So yeah, I don't know, like YouTube's really pushing the idea of like mobile and vertical streams. One, I don't know how to set that up. Two, I don't want the yucky comments and stuff that I feel like that tends to bring. So I'm, I'm holding off on that for the time being. Maybe I'll change my mind about it one day. But today is not the day. Today is not the day. Love your outfit and game. Literally wearing the same thing. Twins, we're ready for the update. I mean, let's go. Okay, last area of this biome. I need to get rid of this night thorn in the corner. You know, I'm just gonna remove these three night thorns because I know they're gonna be in my way. Oh God. Oh God, it's happening. Oh no, Eric's coming. All right, let's clean this up. I feel like I'm the only person on the planet who doesn't have a cell phone. How is that? Cause that, Kind of sounds rad. Since I got rid of having social media, I've, I never felt so better. A lot of streamers that did mobile streaming encounter a lot of trolls for short. See, so yeah, I don't like that. I don't like that. I mean, it, it must come down to like, hopefully they can improve the algorithm so that users who are stumbling upon that content, it, it, it's more their speed and they're not just like, oh, what is this? Like, I just don't get taking the time time out of your day to, uh, I mean, uh, just just keep scrolling. Just keep scrolling. You got nothing nice to say, just keep scrolling. That's it. Um, I don't know where this might fit. If anywhere, uh, I mean, it's just kind of, where does it go? I, I don't know. Let me get rid of it for a moment. I feel like I, I, I have everything else dumped here that I haven't used. And I need to try to make sense of it. Now, I want to see something. I'm pretty sure it's not going to work.
But I just have to, I just have to see. It's too big, it's too big. It definitely can't fit over here, right? Uh, yeah, no. Oh, Alex, thank you so much for saying that. I appreciate that. You're literally the nicest person in the world. I don't know if I want to have that reputation, but <laughs> thank you. That is very kind of you to say. Love your content and the energy you bring. Always giving smiles. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wait, that's so cool. Some of you guys don't have cell phones. I love that for you guys. For me, I feel like um, having a, a cell phone is a... It's like a, a safety thing too. Like I, I feel safer having a phone. Like I can call for help if I need to, if something happens, like... But I think, but I, I barely ever talk on the phone. Um, I don't use it for social media purposes. I use it for YouTube pur purposes and texting and like seeing my work schedule and stuff, but not a whole lot else. So playing solitaire. Like I'm real boring on my phone. <laughs> not too much on my phone. And for maps, oh my gosh, for navigation. I would be able to get nowhere. If, if I had to be carrying around like a physical map, I would get nowhere in life. Oh, this thing. What about this in back of the pond? That's awesome. See, no, I don't even download games on my phone. Because I know I have that personality that I can get sucked into stuff like that. So I don't even put it on my phone. What if this is back here? I'm trying to do, okay, so the vibe for this little corner. <clears throat> if you're just joining or you didn't see like part one of decorating this area. Wait, why is that kind of awesome there? I'm trying to do like a reference to, what's his name? Chiron? Let me know how to say his name. I'm hesitating to say his name because I think I'm going to say it wrong. But the guy who brings you on the boat to the underworld... That's what I'm trying to do a reference to. So I thought having the well over here could be cool. We got the little dinghy boat in the pond. And I'm trying to use the well of souls somewhere. I mean, maybe there's a better spot. And then these fences I thought could probably look good over here too. So let's figure this out. Because I, th I think we're on to something here with the, the fountain in the front. Or in the back, rather. That looks cool. And then I also I kind of wanted to do a graveyard. And we need to put the well. So I'll either have the well over here or over here. And then we need a... I think the graveyard will just kind of be perfect for the biome. But also, like, this is how you get to the underworld, darling. You pronounce it like Karen? Wait, you just, like, that's just how I say it? It's Karen? Or is it Charon? 
Like a chair? <laughs> I forget how you say it. I need to hear it. I need to look up how you hear it. <laughs> Bye, Brick Boss. Thanks for hanging out. Good luck with everything. The Forgotten is really stalking me today. She's really excited. She watched this stream the other day and she was like, I heard you were thinking about designing a house for me. I heard you were thinking about designing that nightmare castle for me, Savannah. You want to get on that? Look, she's like, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. <laughs> okay, so we still don't know how to say his name. But you know who I mean. He's like a Grim Reaper looking dude in a hood. The He mans the ferry boat. <laughs> I don't know how to say his name. Thinking maybe those stone slabs as graves might look better than the coffins. You know what? I made a graveyard speed build a long time ago. And I did use those slabs and they did look great. Um, I might need to pull that out. That's actually a really good idea. There's also these, bro, like, we can mix these things around the pond, maybe? <clears throat> it is pronounced like Karen. Google says Karen. <laughs> okay, this is Karen's pond. <laughs> yes, he's the fairy man who carries people to the underworld. The underworld, darling. I just turned into Edna mode today now. Yeah, look at these things. Getting creepy. All right, let me move this stuff. Fishing around this pond might quickly turn into a nightmare, so let's try to keep that in mind. There's a game called The Forgotten City that makes a joke about that. What, that his name is Karen? I just... I'm just laugh like there's nothing wrong with the name. I'm just laughing because I don't know how to say his name just by looking at it, but it's funny to me that it's just you say it like Karen apparently. <laughs> okay. Trees. Trees. We need layer in some trees here so this doesn't look so weird I need like a big I need some big dense trees to kind of blend this in yeah like that that looks cool in English it's pronounced care on is it care on or Karen Oh, look, we're just never gonna know. We may never know. Okay, maybe a dead a dead tree. I feel bad for people who have names that have just turned into like caricature memes of people like i am so sorry to 
to those people. Bye, Lola. Thanks so much for hanging out. I'll be streaming tomorrow for the update if you're available and want to hang. Would love to see you. If not, that's totally fine. Have a great day. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to put some path on this side of the pond, I think. Just in case I need to get around here to fish. Although it's going to be really difficult now that I have a ton of stuff around it and a, a little boat inside. So I wish me luck with that and with that. My mom's name is Karen, but she's so nice and Karen hate makes her sad. See, that's what I'm saying. I feel bad. I feel bad when people do that. Cause like, they have the name before it turned into a meme. I actually know a Karen who's amazing and not like the stereotype at all. See, that's what I'm saying. Let's stop the Karen hate, guys. I mean, it's, I mean, it's fine to dislike that type of person, but maybe we should stop calling it that. Stop calling them that. Unless that's actually their name. <laughs> that's all. Okay, where am I gonna put gravestone? <laughs> she slowly starts running out of room. Yeah, there's certain names that are just ruined. But I mean, that's a last name. <sighs> okay, this is sick. This is cooler than I thought it could be. All right, let me find those slabs because they're pretty big. If we can use them, that's cool. The hate is gonna hate, 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 hate. Where are they? Do, do, do. Katie, welcome back. Working on storage rooms and making some gardens? Sounds delightful. Welcome. Um, I know it took me a while. Here it is. For a while I was like, this item is so stupid. What are you ever going to do with it? They would work here as graves. Or do you think they should be on the side here? Or here. I got to figure out where the well is going. I think that these might look better here instead of the coffins. I agree. How many do we want? I have four. We need a search button. Totally. Okay, maybe I should put this coffin somewhere else. Let's put it here. Uh, wait. They might sit on it, though. Uh, let's put it there. Gaston? I've also never met a Gaston. Um, 
Yes, Henry, get that. Get that hay bale bed. Get that hay bale bed. Got 900 free moonstones. How? How? With the update to Scrooge Shop, does that mean we would get items quicker? Because he's selling more items. I don't know. It's hard to say because we're getting more items. But what if we just keep getting the same items we've been getting? I don't know. Is there a good spot to put this cooking station? We could put it right here. L, hello, welcome in. Yes, we are finishing up the Forgotten Lands. This is the last area to do. Um, don't pay any attention to this well of souls or the fence pieces in the middle of my path. I just kind of plopped them there. Let me see how this cooking station is. I might have put it the wrong way. Is that the way I want it? <laughs> or should we flip it the other way? Or is there a better spot for it? I'm not sure. Yeah, I, I kind of like this better. Then she doesn't have to run around it. All right, so we've got cooking station there. I have a crafting station here. Um, Cassie, hello, welcome in. What's going on? They just posted a short video showing off the armor that's coming in the mailbox. Let's go, new stuff, let's go. Finally got the apothecary shelf. I'm jealous. Scrooge was nice to you today, huh? I still haven't gotten the apothecary shelf. I, I don't have the any of the mushroom furniture. Like I'm missing out on so much. Love how consistent your color palette is. Just subscribe your Forgotten Lands as a vibe. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Elle. I appreciate that. Um, that means a lot, so thank you. Debbie, welcome back. Yes, I am still alive. Look, the, the Forgotten Lands is not done. We're not done here. So I have to figure out, we gotta figure out well on this side? What if the well is here? I'm scared to put it... Okay, maybe if I slide that tree over a little bit. You know what? I'm not going to be scared to put it anywhere because I have a vacuum. And I don't need to worry about things spawning where I can't reach them anymore. We can just put stuff everywhere. And it'll clean it up for us. So what if I have my well tucked back there? It's kind of hard to see this. Can you make a wish? Can you make a wish list that we could look at? I could look out for things in my shop for you. I was, I thought about doing that as a video maybe. <laughs> like my top wanted Scrooge items. Um, and that never happened. But yeah, if you guys still want something like that, I can do that. What if we have a little path up to the well with some graves around it? Uh, 
see if we like this. Something like this, and then the path can go zoom, zoom. Oh, I need to fix this. Oh my gosh, my lurk command still doesn't work right. <laughs> it's so messed up, I don't know how to fix it. <laughs> New name, enjoy your lurk though. <clears throat> No worries, new name. Thank you. Enjoy your lunch. I made myself a banging lunch today. I made like a veggie gyro sandwich with like tomatoes, lettuce, pickled onions. And like a pita wrap. It's really good. I love I love stuff like that. It's one of my favorite foods. It's looking good. Thanks, Debbie. Okay. So bring this here. No, I can shop in other people's stores, even if they're not on Switch. Like, the other day I went to Minty's Valley. I don't think Minty plays on Switch, but yeah, I can shop in other people's stores. The only thing with going to other people's valleys, if they play on other devices, is that... Um, I guess not all their items and stuff may load in. But I haven't really experienced any issues with that. So I think it's fine. Decorista, enjoy your lurk. Good luck with your interview. I hope it goes well. Yeah, if you guys want to still see like a wish list, I don't know. I just thought it would be interesting to, for me to go through all the items and let y'all know which ones I'm most desiring. Because sometimes people come in and they're like, why don't you use this item? And I'm like, I, yeah, I would, but I don't have it. <laughs> yes, that would be nice, except it does not exist in my game. <laughs> And then it could be something I could like continuously update and be like, oh, all right, well, now that I have this, I'm in search of this. <clears throat> Lurking just means that somebody is going to be watching the stream, but they're not going to be actively chatting anymore. So it just lets friends in chat know like, hey, I'm stepping away. If you write something to me, like I'm not ignoring you. <laughs> I just probably didn't see it. Or doing something else. Oh, what if I put the... I need to put the Well of Souls somewhere because I really do love it. I just don't know where. I kind of want to put these behind this. I think it will fit. Do you guys think that Edgar Allan Poe would like this biome? That's the real question. Do you think he would be inspired to write about this biome? Okay. So I could fit one back there. Oh, I'm definitely lurking then. I have too much laundry to avoid and your stream is helping me get through it. I do the same thing. I love to have a stream on while I'm doing laundry. <laughs> you know, anything just to get my mind off actually doing laundry. So good luck with that. 
Have fun with that. Get all your boring chores done today, guys, because tomorrow that update's gonna come and we're not gonna wanna do anything responsible. We're gonna wanna chill on our game. No, don't do that. Love that. I think his brain would explode because he'd never seen a computer before, let alone a video game. Wait, he might actually think I'm a witch. <laughs> He might get some inspiration. Imagine me teaching Edgar Allan Poe a thing or two. <laughs> All right. It's looking cool. It's looking cool. It's a cleaning day today. Tomorrow I have plans to do nothing but play Disney Dreamlight Valley. Let's go. I should think about if there's anything I need to do on my to-do list today. So I can avoid it tomorrow. <laughs> Minty, welcome back. Oh, I'm sorry to hear it was rough. Hope that you can chill out now. It's all over now. Now you can chill. Okay. That's looking cool. It's looking cool. Um, what have you missed? We have been decorate. I've I've not left this by. <laughs> I'm still decorating my forgotten lands. Now I'm at least 300 items deep. I only have 200 more items I can use in my valley. It's scary. Talk about scary, guys. Talk about scary. Have you seen my item limit? Do, do, do. Ooh, decorating my Eternia Isle desert biome. Lovely. Lovely. Edgar Allan Poe would totally be obsessed with Disney Dream Life Valley. <laughs> would he though? Oh, he went to the store today, so you don't have to do it tomorrow. Yeah, I might need to do, I might need to get some groceries today. Because I'm planning on streaming most of the day tomorrow. So it's like, I should probably figure out what I'm having for lunch and stuff tomorrow. <laughs> Today, so that it's done, and I don't have to worry about it. Left for a bit, and it's looking good. Oh my gosh, welcome back in, friends. Thank you. Just doing a little sprucing up by the well here. Well, 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 what do we have here? Ooh, does this fit? Why doesn't it fit? Why? Because that bush? Uh, I don't know if I can walk. Ooh, let's put it here. Let's put that here.
Love the green light close to the wishing well. Thank you. It's actually a fence that you can make from um, having the DLC. It's called Green Bumblestone Fence. And I've recently discovered that I love this, <laughs> this item, especially for this dark biome, because it just adds a little something special, a little color, a little pop of color. I love a little pop of color. Love how you did the area by the tree that brought Jack to the valley. I had to do something cool with that. I was just kind of playing around with that area one night and then I feel like the whole, the whole biome has just taken off since then. Now we're almost done. It's almost fully decorated. And I think that the Sunlit Plateau might be my next project. Is this too many ferns? Does the limit not exist? that. Where's the well gonna go? The well of souls. I guess it's gotta go. Dang, where should I put this? This is one of my favorite items. I can't not use it. Well, I don't know. Is it one of my favorite items? I really do like it. <laughs> I don't know if I should say it's one of my favorite though. Should we put it in front of the hotel? You're not gonna walk up there anyway. If you do, it's all downhill. It's all downhill. Yes, it's a fence. It's a fence, but it's really like one individual piece. It's not like you can click it and drag it like the other fences. Yeah, the switch has a lower item limit. It can only handle 3,000. I'm gonna play on switch. Let's see how this is looking. I think I need to do something here. I don't like how that really looks. What do we think? <clears throat> what do we think? How much longer are you streaming for? I don't know. I have no idea. <clears throat> Just kind of seeing what's happening. that there is there something here no okay let me get rocks any other spooky kind of items I've forgotten about that maybe we should have in this biome is there anything that you are like oh my god why did you not put the item out Yeah, I have to finish this at least. And then I don't know, I might do, I might decorate more. Just in the decorating mood. I'm glad you're able to make today's stream as well. Thanks for being here.
the nightmare, hang on. So the nightmare before Christmas, the hill is over here. I put it over here. So it's kind of subtle. What I just noticed, I put the hill by the pond and then I put the fountain of youth behind this pond. Owen, welcome in. What's going on? How are you? Okay, we need more. We need some glowing flowers in the graveyard. Because obviously. Because need I even explain? Let me see. Can this go somewhere? Doing okay. I'm doing so well. I'm I'm so excited for the update tomorrow. We've just been decorating the forgotten lands literally for the entire stream. <laughs> We're getting towards the end of decorating this area, but I might swap to another location next. That's cute, 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 cute. Let's bring this somewhere. Where will this fit? there. Where are all the other flowers? Don't tell me I used... Did I use... I, lit I really used all of them? Okay, I'm not putting any more. I'm not... I'm trying not allow myself to use any more of those flowers. Now this area. Also, I don't know... Do we like the well there? No, I don't like it there. I might put it back in front of the castle. Unless it can go somewhere here. Uh, maybe it will work here. Maybe if I make this path like a little area. And just kind of make this like a filler space. Maybe we'll have a villager house that makes sense to move here in the future. But if and until then, this will be a good little filler spot and I honestly probably won't really walk this way I also want to find a spot to put the this little thing the vacuum this well was from was it the first star path from the first Halloween star path I was it the first star no the first star path was the Pixar one, right? From one of the first ones. It really just looked like Mickey just stole that coin. It looked like he just popped over and was like, oh, I'll take that. Thanks. Thanks, Af. Thank you, Owen. What? Wait. We're at 95 likes. What? When did that happen? Are you serious? When did that happen? Um, excuse me? What are you guys even doing? 
Thank you. If I put a fence around a villager's entire house, would they be trapped in there? Uh, I, I guess because like this stuff keeps spawning right in front of Scar's house and then he gets stuck there. But I think unless they have to spawn, unless they're spawning at like the restaurant or in the shop, then I don't think you'll see them. Oh, maybe the Maleficent throne could go on the other side of this well. Wonder how that might look. And I need more trees. Trees, please. Eight now? You guys are absolutely crushing it. <laughs> the most likes you've gotten on a stream while live? I don't know. I don't know. I don't keep track. That's a hot that's high from what I usually get though, I think. So thank you. Those are showing so much love on the channel. And it really does help creators out. I mean, just you guys even just hang out and watching the stream, like that really helps the channel out. But the likes, especially liking, subscribing really helps the creators. So it helps like the algorithm and YouTube know to continue to push out the content to other people who might like it. Oh my gosh, 99 now? Okay, we're one, one like away. Who wants to ring the magic button? <laughs> Get to 90, or I'm sorry, 100 likes. 100. You guys are acting like the update is today. Well, the update is tomorrow. I'm gonna need y'all to show back up tomorrow and do the same thing on the stream tomorrow, okay? You can be here. That's y'all's homework for tomorrow. Yay, we hit 100 likes. Thank you guys so much. That's awesome. Look at that confetti. Woohoo! <laughs> Let's get a heart spam. Thank, oh, thank, thank you for streaming. Well, thank you for being here. This is fun. I'm having fun. Do you guys, you guys, I hope you guys know that this is a lot more fun for me to decorate, decorate and hang out with you guys than if I'm just sitting on my own and I'm like, Constantly changing my mind. Having fun still, but constantly changing my mind and being like, uh, is this good? Is this how it should be? <laughs> too many decisions, too many options. Aw, thank you guys. Look at all the love. Look at those little sav kissy emojis. And the confetti, I love it. Thank you. Thank you. 101 Dalmatia likes. <laughs> that's clever. Now that's clever. I need Maleficent to come in the game. So I have another villager to put up here. Although Maleficent could also probably like my Glade of Trust. Which I call my bad girls club. I feel like she would love that. Living with Mama G and Ursula. So what if we have this here? And, oh my gosh, I'm out of path. Do I need more path? Imagine if Eric came right over and just <laughs> sat down immediately. Banish him. 
No worries, Minty. I know, you've got, you've got stuff going on. It's all good, it's all good. Shauna, welcome in. So excited for tomorrow and don't think I'm gonna be able to sleep. I'm gonna make myself sleep. I'm gonna make myself get a good night's rest so we can come in here hot, high energy, hype for the update and get it going. I'm doing so great. We've just been hanging out decorating the Forgotten Lands. So we're about we're about finished. You know, I got to give the monsters something to be proud of. I'm trying to wow Mike and Sully so they're like, "Oh, yeah, we'll live here." doesn't want to fit. This chair has like a pretty big space it takes up. Oh wait, maybe that looks weird. It's kind of digging into the other tree. Like Maleficent would take over the Bad Girls Club, she'd be like the Regina <laughs> George. <gasps> uh, that would be awesome. You know, I feel like she's really more more so just like a loner. I don't know if that's her choice. It's just kind of what became of her. This one looks bigger. That one's not gonna fit. Maybe we'll stick that back there. What about the dead? This one. Ooh, that looks cool. And then maybe a tiny Oh, you know what? Let's do a scraggly bush. It's been a while since we threw a scraggly bush in. Perfect. Perfect. Just found five pixel shards in the Frosted Heights? I didn't know you could find them after your friends left. I need... Okay, what do the pixel shards make? What can you craft with them? I don't have that many. I need to start grinding for them. Okay. Now, we might want 
to just scatter in a few of these over here. Wherever they might fit. Okay. Um, another thing I need to add are maybe a few lights. So let's put one here. Taylor, hello, welcome in. I'm doing well, how are you? <clears throat> All right, do we need any more lights? Actually don't really like that one there. We'll know when we walk around. <gasps> Guys, I think it's done. Is it done? I think it's done. I think, well, actually, wait, wait, wait. I have all this stuff. Okay, these are chests from like my garden. Maybe we can make, oh wait, maybe we can make some green ones. And then this thing, where do I want this? Do I want it by my pumpkins? By fairy godmother? Maybe just here? little inconspicuous vacuum moment? I don't know. Ooh, went to the mall. I wanna go shopping. <laughs> okay, honestly, we can get rid of this chest. Can get rid of this one too. I'm gonna sell a bunch of these vegetables. Let me throw the flowers in here and move this stuff. I just sell, well wait, let's see. Do I have space in here? Okay, let's put some full stacks. Let's put, let's put the tomatoes, the lemons. Peppers. I'm gonna sell everything else. And then this chest just has my dark wood and my dry wood. So let me sell this stuff. Hi there, pal. Well, hi there. Hey, howdy, hey. All right, let's get rid of these. selling all this. I need to get some money back here from all those pumpkin seeds. Erin, hello, welcome in. Good evening from the UK. Hello to the UK. Hope you're well. 
And excited for the update. I'm so excited. Love Monsters Inc. We're so excited. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, I feel like the Moonstone chests do spawn more on Eternity Isle. Now you got six pixel shards. Okay, what do the pixel shards make though? What do they make? What do you craft with them? Update is 9 a.m. Eastern Time tomorrow. I will be streaming as soon as the update happens. <laughs> I'll be here. You know where to find me. You know what's up. Um, the Forgotten's about to scare all your visitors away. So, let me get rid of these. I kind of want to make one large green chest. Let's see if I have one. No. Okay, let me craft one. Because I think that'll just suit this area a lot nicer. <laughs> wait, you can still, wait, can you get the pixel shards? if you play with other PlayStation players or you can't get them at all for some reason. Um, what was I looking for here? Oh, a chest, a chest, I forgot. Totally blanked. You know what's up. Don't know what the sh pixel shards do, so you you can craft with them. I don't get it. Why are there two of these? Okay, this one is ten. Does this just give you more? Pixel shards? I don't get it. Somebody please explain. <laughs> We're at 105 likes. What in the world? Thank you guys. All right, these chests. I'm guessing should be by Goofy's stall, maybe? Somewhere in this area? You use them so that you don't use your resources to craft? What do you mean? You make buffs for cooking and crafting. Okay, I still don't get it. 
I still don't get it. Mm, okay. My chest should be by this vacuum. I think. I mean, I could put the vacuum somewhere else though. Should it be over here? In the front of the biome? I don't know where it looks good. Where am I gonna use it the most? I wish it was glowing green, like the blue is throwing me off. Should it just go here? It's kind of nice there actually. And then maybe just the chest. the green chest I'm gonna put a dry wood a dark wood and my pumpkin seeds everything else is gonna be cleaned up I mean, the chests there are really just, they're functional. They don't look that cute, they're functional. Um, okay. Little walkthrough. Wait, wait, wait a second. Let me set the, let me set the vibe. Oh my god, Eric's here? This place is so scary. All right, so entrance to the biome. Oh, it's looking cool over here. We've got the wishing well. Amongst the graveyard. And then we have the portal to the underworld. With the fountain of youth. There's a story there between these two things being together, I guess. The Fountain of Youth and also how you get to the underworld. Choose your destiny, I guess. Wish we were able to make pink chests. We have pink crafting stations too. Okay, that's our little entryway. To the left, we have the Haunted Hollywood Tower Hotel. Now you may check into this hotel, but you probably will not check out. So that's here. And then over here, this is um, maybe like a food truck with the menu outside. Maybe it's just a little car with the menu for the hotel's restaurant. I don't know, something, there's something there. Use your imagination. We have the tree house, which I love the little signs in front of it. Um, and then to the right, we have a pumpkin patch, but let's go this way. Here we have the nightmarish castle, soon to be turned into the forgotten's domain. And I think this is looking really cool tucked over here. 
I love the Ancients Landing stuff all in this biome too. I think it looks really good. Guys, I might have to do a little tour video. A little, little valley tour update. Soon. Sometime soon. Here we have Jack's house. Of course, the Pumpkin King himself has to live in this biome because where else would he live? Uh, excuse me? That is not for you. That's not for you. Anyway, since we're here, we have this unfortunate villager modeling the Pumpkin King's throne for us. We have automatic gardeners. For all the pumpkins, when these grow in, it's gonna be immaculate over here. We have this gorgeous little display to hide all those ugly crystals you don't wanna see. So that's a little tribute to Jack, obviously. Now Jack needed a neighbor, so we brought Fairy Godmother in. So she's chilling amongst the pumpkin patch back in her OG place. And then we just got more pumpkins because you can never have too many pumpkins. You can never have too many pumpkins. Zero's house looks so cute under that little tree. I like to see Zero walking around over here. He's perfect. We could put another one of these and have like the scary squirrel running around. Maybe for the Forgotten's house. I don't know. It's kind of close to that one though. Maybe by the tree house. Maybe by the tree house we should have the scary squirrel walking around. Where does Eric get the audacity? I don't know. Somebody told him he's a prince or something. So he just has like a big head. It's kind of annoying. Yes, you can get more volcanic stoves from Scrooge. You have to put it in your pocket though. I think you have to bring Scar with you. I forget. Um. We love the Eric Gross. Sometimes I feel bad because the Little Mermaid is my favorite, but I just don't like Eric in the game. He just, he ticks me off. Okay, I said it. I find him infuriating. There's nowhere to put this. Should I put it back there and have the, let's see. I want the scary squirrel to be like walking around over here though. All right, we might move this, but. Squirrel. <laughs> yeah, he's too hidden back here. Hey, I want to spread him out. <laughs> but I like having the squirrel up here, too. Uh, okay. So, let's see. I think the squirrel with the treehouse makes sense. I kind of want him in this area. If it doesn't work out, that's fine. I guess I could get rid of this bush. Let's 
Is it weird to have two of the zero houses though? Love the Nightmare Before Christmas music. Look, we got we had to set the tone. We had to set the vibe. The squirrel, the squirrel with the treehouse. I'm into it. He looks good. He he would live there. All right, I found out who lives in the treehouse. It's the squirrel. It's the scary squirrel. Yeah, I like to see the critters walking around here. I don't mind that there's another zero house. It's fine. Okay. Forgotten Lands is done. Rip my item count because the Forgotten Lands is done. Okay, I'm going to... I'm not going to end the stream right now. Because I think we're all still chilling and hanging out and having a good time. And I appreciate y'all keeping the energy high and exciting. Um, and thank you so much for all the likes. I'm going to um, fill my drink and use the restroom. And I'll be right back. And then I think we'll check out my school rock and maybe do something over there. All right. I'll be right back. Chat amongst yourselves. Everybody behave. The sea air is great. <laughs> I might hear you suggest. Um, excuse me. When I said you could chat amongst yourselves, that did not include talking about Pinocchio. That is forbidden in my chat. I'm gonna ban Pinocchio from my words you can use in my chat. <laughs> I'm gonna ban him from my chat. Y'all stop it, stop it, stop it. Don't be ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous, you guys. You don't like Pinocchio. 
Stop the nonsense. Okay. Let's go. Oh, you know what? Let's make it nice out. Let's nice out. Stop, you guys. Stop it. It's not allowed. That is not allowed. Ashy is an instigator. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Okay. So everybody's like, skull rock this, skull rock that. I'm scared because my skull rock island looks like a pooey. Looks like Pooey over here. Um, because I ban I just threw all these random items here that I had on my beach. Cause I'm also redoing my beach. Can I pick this wheel up? So let's figure this out. Let's just try to do a fairly simple pirate homage. I think we can do that. First of all, we need to get rid of this. This eyesore. I swear it's actually always in this spot. Do you guys feel like your rifts are constantly spawning in the same area? I don't know why I say, said spawning. Like, spawning? Okay, where? It's 72 degrees right now and supposed to be back in the 40s tomorrow. I don't understand. I don't understand. I think it might be nice for me today, but I've not gone outside today. I probably should. I probably should. Do, do. Okay, let's get rid of this one. This one. I'm not gonna do anything too crazy here because you really can't do much. But I have these nice pirate items. I do wanna use them. So let's do a little something something. I guess I should clean up more of this coral. I think it's gonna be in my way. try to avoid cleaning up the night thorns unless I really need to. Let's get the flowers out of the way. What do we think? Okay, is something supposed to happen in the update with Skull Rock? I don't remember. I need to look back at the roadmap. Okay, I like where my portal is. I don't really want this here. I do like this stuff. I think this is cool, but I don't know where it should go. All right, let's move it to the side. And I like these lanterns too. Maybe the lanterns. Over here somewhere. Oh, I can turn the Halloween music off. Sheesh. Sheesh. All right, let me do that. We're tired of this. Well, let me do this playlist. <clears throat> I 
I wish we could get the stuff from the cozy edition without having to buy that. Because I saw that purple raccoon today and I was like, mm, I kind of do want those other <laughs> companions and the sweater. But I don't even think I can get it. Because I can only play on my Switch. These I'm liking to use on my beach. I wonder if we can lead it up to this little boat here. I need to make more of those. Tropical wood floor. And then I kind of want to put these little dinghies all over. Oh, so yeah, I wish we could just buy the cosmetics without having to buy the whole... everything else. Uh, oh wait, I have to craft. Okay, I can't remember. I think that the thing is in furniture. Even though it's a path. Just like these are fences, but they're in furniture. I don't I don't get it. I don't get it. The cozy edition is ten dollars off, and you for moonstones. You mean, and you can use it on your switch because it's a code you put in the game. Even though I've already purchased it on my switch, are you telling me I should get it then? Is it worth? Is it worth it though? Like I already have the purple cottage. Is it worth it? Let me work it. Let's put these up to the well. Ooh, you can put it under the well too. Now that's divine. like that. That looks cool. It has 1450 moonstones. I have to buy it in person though. Where on earth am I gonna find it? I feel like I go to Target and I'm like I'll look for something like amiibo cards or something. They never have them. They don't have stuff like that. <laughs> In stock ever. Ooh, we could have a little pirate table thing off the dock situation, maybe. How did I how did I do this before? I had a cute little area set up with all my pirate stuff here. And then I destroyed it because I was making a speed build. But I think this is cool for the Skull Rock situation. I wonder if I should put path leading up to the skull. Like going like this. You can get it on Amazon. Are you guys telling me that that's what I should go and buy now? Is that what you guys are telling me? I'm still not convinced. Look, I want those things, but I'm still not convinced. 
that I need to buy another copy of this game. And I haven't been spending real money to buy Moonstones because I've just been getting them from doing my Dream Snaps. So I feel like the Moonstones are not even really that appealing. All right, I need to make a couple more pieces. Y'all just wait. When my beach is done, we're gonna be we're gonna be chilling over here. We're gonna be proper chilling. Take all my materials. All right. Let's get more path down. You have to disconnect. Oh, why do you have to disconnect from the cloud? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want to do all that. I also don't know if I want to do all that. <laughs> it's worth it to buy the cozy edition plus the bonus free moonstone. But I'm already getting free moonstones from doing my dream snacks. I already have the purple cottage. Wait, I don't, I don't think I can put one more piece. Okay. Okay, I need more, I need one of those clusters of the trees. Let's put that here. DDB posted something on Discord. I'll check in just a moment. Think like that. All right, let me investigate. What are they posting? What are they saying now? What are they saying now? If you already have the purple cottage, they gave you back the moonstones that you paid for it with in addition to the moonstones that come with the pack am i understanding that right oh okay so they just posted that it is going to be 9 a.m eastern time I guess it says whatever time the update launches for you. For me, it says 9 a.m. Eastern time. So do your conversion for your time zone. I will be streaming. I will have a stream scheduled um, after my stream today, whenever we decide that we're done decorating. <laughs> I think this is gonna be the last bit of decorating I'm gonna do for today. Mm. 
Good to know. I was wondering why they had not confirmed the time. Uh, what do you guys think of the stuff kind of on the path? Like, should this be more on the sand? That's what I'm trying to decide. Oh, you know what I used before? Leaf piles. That looks good under this desk. That's what it's missing. Oh, you can't put the leaf piles with the planks, though? Okay, maybe our little pirate station should go over here, then. With like a tree up, a tree above it. I don't know, I gotta fill, it, fill the space up. It's 3 a.m. for you. That is just inconsiderate that they would do that to you. I'm sorry. But at least when you wake up, it'll be there. It'll be there. That's like, I think that's like when the Fortnite updates were dropping for me and a couple of them I have stayed up that late waiting. This tree doesn't want me to put it anywhere. What about beach grass? Good old trusty beach grass. I don't know if the beach grass goes through the planks. It's looking like no. I can't tell if this is the one I want. Uh, oh, it is. I think it is? Oh yeah, it is. All right, so it can't go on the planks. Must be new, I never got Moonstones back from the Purple Cottage? Uh-oh. See, that's got me nervous. Then it's really not worth it. this tree I just a lot of times I pull it out like oh I'll use this one and then I just don't <laughs> it's annoying to me for some reason <laughs> okay let's do a little palm tree there move these barrels Put that there and then like the standing up one behind it. There's also the treasure, like piles of treasure item. Do I want to use that? together nicely well thank you it's certainly looking better than it did when I started where I just had junk tossed around every which way let's 
do that. A couple of barrels. Now, I'm pretty sure that pirate treasure item is not in the Pirates of the Caribbean collection. Where is it? Here we go. I don't know. I was not looking for an icon like that. I was looking for like a skull. <laughs> oh, let's put these out. Okay. What is that item under? How can I find it? I'm looking for the thing from the star path that's like a pile of treasure. I think one kind of on the shore is kind of cute. Guys, how about this swan that's in the star path? This little swan boat. So cute. Something I didn't even know I needed. <clears throat> All right, let's get a couple of palm trees over here. Any more beach grass? Really easy for me to go wild with the beach grass. How much can I put? Uh, what's a reasonable amount of beach grass? Asking for a friend. Brandy, hello, welcome in. First time being on a live stream, but love watching all the videos. So excited for this new update. Thank you. So happy you could catch me live. Um, I'm also really looking forward to the update tomorrow. I think we're going to have a lot of fun. Um, anytime we get new content added into the game, I feel like it's definitely a good time. So I'm definitely looking forward to it. And I appreciate the support. I'm glad you like my content and everything. Thanks for being here. Uh... Let's put one over there. I feel like these would be better by this table. Maybe just one. Maybe I just want one torch. Yeah, they said all my favorite star path items are gonna come back. I don't, not every single star path item is gonna come back. Probably just like ones people have really requested. Like I'm pretty sure there's a good chance like the Disney parks stuff, like the Ferris wheel. I think that's probably one of the top requested items a lot of people probably want. The up balloons. Uh, what else do you guys think? What other star path items do you think we'll probably see? I think maybe the Well of Souls or the... I'm pretty sure those trees, the scary, like, web-snared trees, the ones that have spider webs on them, 
I think those will probably be in the, in the premium shop. Like, those are just some items that I feel like I, like when I use them, people are like, how'd you get that? Where is that from? Um, so I, to me, I feel like those are more popularly requested items. Oh, I should also mix in some treat, some um, little shrubs and stuff from Attorney Isle, right? Let's look at that. Christian, welcome back. Alright, let's put some of these little doohickeys down. I like them. We're at 110 likes. What is going on? What's going on today, guys? Thank you. Um, fan leaf plant. Okay, this goes on the beach for sure. Look at this. Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think that my valley decorating's complete? Wouldn't you think I can't possibly put out any more items? You'd be surprised. I can still put more items out. Okay, let's do... <laughs> Maybe this one. Oh, now this one is pretty cool. Ooh, I, I kind of like it by this chair. May have been that 110 like. Well, thank you. Well, thank you. Oh, we're just like kind of vibing with the decor now, huh? That's how I feel like. Sometimes I just start decorating and then I'm like, mm, yeah, just keep going. It's looking good. I'm in the spirit. I'm in the spirit. Spirit now, guys. Um, I feel like I have one more different kind of items though. Crates. How do we feel about the crate? Maybe a crate back there. decide if I like I guess I don't like the stuff on the path can I move that smidge go and then we could put something on top of the crates if we're feeling very adventurous we could also do a stack like the pile of crates would be good Uh, what? Not the stack, I want the pile. Like the cluster. put this little boat <laughs> this is the kind of thing I'm like yeah it's cute but it's another item it's eating up my item limit Yes, I know which um, item. Oh, this is the one. I know what item you're talking about, Minty. I have it on my beach. 
this one. This banner. That's also probably another one people do want. If you missed out on that one, that's probably another one a lot of people want. Now, do we want this pirate thing here? Is there simply no room? I think there's gonna be simply no room for it. And that's fine. That's fine. Oh, a pile of scrolls. This is what I want. Pile of crates. Oh, I kind of like it by the well. That's cool. I want this really tall one. <gasps> you can put this on top of... <laughs> what in the world? Oh, the companions. Now, I don't know if they're going to bring the companions back. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's that much more I could possibly fit on this tiny little island. Hi. A bundle for each star path? I, I doubt it. I don't know, do I need another boat? All right, let me see, do I wanna put in any more underbrush stuff? Thinking maybe more of these tropical plants. Yeah, like this one's kind of cool. Do we know if we we're gonna find out about Skull Rock? I don't remember, is it on the road path? Does anybody know? <laughs> road map, I mean, not the road path. stuff here and it's looking pretty good it's looking lush okay I might want I don't know any lights any lights look good over here? Tiki torches? Pop in some tiki torches.
All right, that's a cute little like filler build for that area. Maybe this will motivate me to decorate the rest of my beach and it's raining. Okay, great. And on that note, <laughs> I don't think there's any more decorating I can do in the rain today. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. All right, friends. Thank you guys so much for all the love on the stream today. You guys have been fantastic. Can't wait to do it all again tomorrow. Um, I'll be streaming for the update. 9 a.m. Eastern time. I'll probably start schedule it like schedule it like 10, 15 minutes before the update. Um don't believe they actually mentioned Skull Rock. For now, it's one big mystery to be solved. I can't remember. I gotta look at the roadmap again, but I think that did say something about Skull Rock. But I, I'm not, I can't remember. I can't keep everything straight. Um, thank you guys so much for helping me with decorating. I've had a lot of fun today. I'm gonna go work on finishing up my video for that I started filming this morning. That's actually not totally done yet um but yeah i don't know when i'm gonna be posting that probably not before the update probably be after the update um if you haven't already be sure to like this stream be sure to subscribe ring your notification bell so you don't miss when i'm going to be live tomorrow i'll also pop in the discord link um in the chat so y'all can join discord that's one of the best places to be so that you get notifications for when I'm live. Um, Cause sometimes YouTube doesn't give you all notifications, I think. Aw, new name, thank you so much. Yes, absolutely no worries. Thank you, Minty, thank you. Rewatch the stream tomorrow. All right guys, I will see you guys tomorrow 9 a.m. Don't forget to do your dream snap today. If you didn't do your dream snap today, do your dream snap. You're going to want the moonstones tomorrow. So make sure you do that. Well, I guess it would be in a week or two weeks from now. But anyways, you guys know I'm going to stop blabbering. I'm going to go finish up my video and chill and anxiously await for the update tomorrow. Thank you guys so, so much for hanging out. All the likes, all the love. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.